one. Go. No. No. Oh, damn. Hi. Hey, hello, hello you two. Hello. This is... Hello. Hello. It's been a while since I've DM'd again. It's been uh, a while. This is, I guess, it's a con... This one is like a continuation from... A... <laughs> A one shot that happened a long time ago called A Night of Mask and Monsters. How long was that? Actually? A month, so a year? Long that was long, long ago. I think a year. Time yeah. to a check. Minute. Time to check this, the vods. Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> following, following the story of our fellow Creed and Lilibet. This is titled Curse of ah. Creations with. I guess. One week from now, after the events of Anomam. And mm -hmm. right now, we are in the setting of. Yeah, it's been a year a, a since town, the last time. Yeah. A town right. Creed and Lilibeth would be venturing their way into called Hammerhead. In this right. town of Hammerhead, is a rather lively and bustling situated a bit closer to the forest. Filled with farms, ranches, and of course taverns of adventurers. Many people travel here for its livestock and rich quality in meat they provide for provisions. It's also a small place for mercenaries to catch a break from their duties and own a small empty area nearby where they make small camp. As long as they follow the conditions and not cause any trouble, they are free to rest in the town as they please. And within the entrance of Hammerhead are... Two individuals making their way inside the post, looking to find someone who can help on their, well, situation. And as I change screen, I would like Johnny and Retro to reintroduce their characters. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, look at him. Wow. I don't know. You want to go first or should I? Uh, for uh, <laughs> large, imposing, fucking m metal beast of a thing, standing at a seven, standing at seven foot five. This uh, extremely tall, metallic creature with uh, these glowing blue tube, purple tubes running all over his body, flowing with some kind of liquid. His eyes glowing the same color. Large, large, sharp metal clawed hands. A large pauldron on one shoulder and a small saddle on the other. Uh, that's Creed, all right. Nice. So, I, yeah, and on that said, that saddle that. He mentioned sits there a three foot four small halfling on his. Okay. <laughs> Wait, I meant this. <laughs> the yeah, he has uh, black hair, black eyes, tannish skin. She has a guitar slinged over her shoulder. She uh, how can I explain her clothes? Well, it's more dramatic in a sense. Of as opposed to her last clothes, she, she it's obvious she grown a bit from when she when we first saw her. Yeah, that's a bit. Mm hmm. Ja uh, a little bit with new drip, but yes. Um, you walk your way in what looks like ta ha the town of Hammerhead. You see two guards on the post greeting you, as well as a captain. Who looks to be in charge of the entrance? He gives you a nod and a. Not really questioning the or if the large warforge with black paint and well rusted, <laughs> rusted dents. And a lot of scratches. It's it's a really, it's a actually large town. Yeah, we, it's the weepy iron cards. <laughs> <laughs> the town is relatively big, and by big you'll know soon enough. As you're walking by, it's eh, not that active as you would expect it to be. You see more guards, and as you walk here, you hear a commotion at the uh, right side from where you're standing. It's like it sounds like people yelling and cheering, and you hear a large female voice saying, 
All right. Who wants to be volunteers? We need volunteers to help us with our mission. And uh, little Beth, since you're on, you can see multiple heads crowding around, and it looks like there's a brawl going on. A little bit. Well, wow. <laughs> she'll step on her tippy toes and to get a clear view. <laughs> Oh, I Just think there's a brawl going on. Your... on. Yep. Really? Oh damn! Oh. I forgot. Oh voice. my god, your voice retro. I hope your voice <laughs> no, died by the end of this. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it go. It's been a while since I felt that burn. Yeah. Ooh. Oh my god! Ooh. Please don't kill your voice. It's we just don't started. Kill your voice, <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think there is. But, um, I think we should stay focused while we're here, remember? Maybe. Jesus. I'm gonna look over in that direction. Okay. You look over and... Yeah, it's, it's definitely crowded here. You see a few people. Like, a woman and a guard and a smaller looking figure. And as you actually go closer, you start to see very a bit more clearly what's going on as two what looks to be beginner mercenaries are fighting it out, looking like they are going giving out a show for a well, as you can guess right, a brawl. And as we get closer from the brawl, I would like Ozzy and Kaito to introduce their characters. Yeah. Oh. Hey, yeah, All right. Um, hmm. Kaido goes first. Me? Uh, actually, no. I'm nervous because I'm not. Okay, fine. Fine. I got water. Bottle. You go first, Azzy. Okay, so my character's name: Layla, a Tabaxi Ranger, a Gloom Stalker. Tabaxi Gloom Stalker Ranger. Kind of inspired her. She's a leopard of sorts. Or there's not much furry. <laughs> furry. Furry. <laughs> furry. <laughs> furry. <laughs> it's the furry squad. Yeah, it's the yeah. furry yeah. squad. All I can say about can I oh. say <laughs> their relationship between like sh the other furry? Yo. Me. Uh, I mean, no, uh, it's like, Shadow. Shadow's the name. It's just like they're having they're having a brawl. It's like si sibling. Rival rivalry, sibling rivalry, but they're cousins. Yeah, sibling yeah. rivalry. That's how it's worth. I'd call that sibling rivalry. Yeah. Uh oh, am I gonna introduce myself then? Yeah. Okay. Um. I uh the cat uh, I am Shadow and I am a, t a Tabaxi rogue. Uh. Um, a little, I would say I'm, like, more, I would say my character would be more focused with, like, um, with, uh, being a little, being faster and more stealthy kind of way. That That's the mm -hmm. best thing that I could, um, imagine my character to be, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's good enough. And yeah. as they actually pan out more, you actually see how many people there are here. Oh and... boy. <laughs> the the crowds like some of them are worried, some of them are cheering them on. This one is attentively observing these two and anyone who would look promising. Uh Creed, you can tell from your past experience that she is indeed a leader of a mercenary. And uh, I guess, let's see. Ozzy and you Kaito, you can roll me. <laughs> initiative? Oh, wait, I'm. <laughs> no, 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 not, in not initiative. It's just uh, who who gets. Uh, basically, who the other first. Like, I guess roll okay. me both a. Roll me both a constitution check and a dexterity save. <laughs> uh, wait, sorry, what? what's the roll? Con. Roll me a constitution save. A check first. Yeah, check not check. save. 
Oof. Oof, first roll of the game. Ooh, let's go. <laughs> and what save? Oh, wait. Uh, how do I roll? How do I roll? Hold up. Oh, uh. Um. You type exclamation mark small r. Small and r and then space. D20. D20. Plus whatever your D20. con mod is. Wait, and D20. what your constitution oh, mod is. Uh. Uh, let me check. Constitution mod plus two. Yeah, yeah then yeah. add up I... plus two. Okay, so I guess that's it then. Oh, oh shit! Yes. Oh wow! No. Oh dear lordy! Oh boy! And oh, boy. roll me a roll me a dexterity saving throw as well. Uh, okay. Uh, it's just it's just to luck. check if you can beginner's you can still luck. keep your ground. Yeah. It's... Oh. Pretty decent. <laughs> oh fuck! Up, oh, wait. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, okay. Boy. Um, Creed, you're an expert mercenary, and you can definitely freshly recruited. Mm -hmm. And the the how which ones which ones taller than you guys? Uh, let me check. Uh, where's the fucking height? Uh, mine's six foot two. Oh damn! Oh, oh my god. You can see the dark furred tabaxi looking uh, person. <laughs> I don't know the gender. <laughs> Male, don't worry. Run up, run up, run up to their friend who isn't as act, isn't as quick and swift as her other counterpart. As she <laughs> she gets roundhouse kicked and gets thrown to the ground. But it's, yep. Yeah. But right. she expertly rolls, like, does a Assassin's Creed roll and saves herself from hitting her head on the ground. This one, however, it trips on a rock and um, <laughs> hits his head. Nice, I love that. Uh, fucking amateurs. <laughs> <laughs> uh. ah, let me unsnap you guys to the grid. She's here, and she's he's currently just right up down there. <laughs> uh, well, they're just beginners. Who oh, knows? They might get better. Baby, <gasps> oh, I'm sloppy. I, uh, Kaito and uh, Azzy, you can feel free to talk to each other as well. You're right. <laughs> oh. Um. Supposed to be fast. Um. Uh, <laughs> ah! Ah! Uh, um. Fuck. I, I, I really need to, like, gather my thoughts for this one. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get! Says, says Layla. Ah, <laughs> uh, ah. Uh. Look, uh, I can't really think that much. It's, uh, it's okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. I no, I kind of meant that like an action because I uh, I tripped. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you can really. Layla's over uh, here with a smug face. I can assume. Hmm. No fair to you. No fair to. Chew. No fair. I definitely won that one. No fair. <laughs> I won, but at what cost? <laughs> <laughs> I won it if it wasn't for that damn fucking rock. <laughs> As you guys are uh, bickering and then Creed's over here criticizing the beginners, you hear. From your, I guess, increased perspective, your left, you hear this woman say, That sound, that sounds familiar. She glances over here. Oh, hmm. Yeah, next time I'm Black go armor, this. purple liquid. And is that someone on his shoulder? She walks, step forward. Creed, is that you? 
Oh, looking, looking at looking at her uh, outfit, she's a mercenary captain, from what you can see, and on her ch- on her chest, uh, like it's a brooch with almost the same signia of another friend you visited before here, which was a high cleric that cured her a little bit. Oh, it's you. Oh, you know her. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad you remembered me. After that long. It's your friend. Uh, yeah, I know her. I'm gonna take one of my claws and just take it out of my head. Kind of hard to forget shit, you know. <laughs> she she chuckles and says. Still haven't changed, haven't you? Oh, and she looks up to you, little bit on his shoulders. Are you a friend of his? Mm-hmm. Hi, I'm little bit. Uh, get best friend actually. I never knew you were the social one, Creed. Not. She's special. Aww. <laughs> Aww. You gotta love it. And. Oh, excuse my apologies. You can call me Deborah. 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 I Deborah, shot my yeah. purses at Deborah. Oh yeah, here it is. I keep forgetting that. Oh, <clears throat> and what brings you here in Hammerhead? The the guard oh, right now is okay. just helping out these two. Oh well, uh, you go, you go. I'm gonna just kind of take her around with my arm. Business. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're looking for a high cleric. We heard there was one here. Oh, you mean the priestess here? Is there something you need healing? You don't look like you're hurt right now. Uh, um, something like that. Yeah, it's more um, um internalized, I suppose. Well, it's periodic, I suppose. Yeah. Yep. Oi, 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 we're just getting started! Shadow, let's go for round two! <laughs> this, <laughs> this one just yells out loudly in the background. Also, it's a rumor. It's... We, heard, uh, we, we heard about the rumors, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I just wanted to yeah. make sure I'm everything. Yeah. Oh yeah. You heard it way back in Anomam as well. Anomam, yeah. yeah. So he is like, like, he's gonna hit something in his arm, and then this circular, this circular dagger just comes flying out of his fist. Also heard some rumors. Someone's around here. Which someone? An inventor, tinker of some sort. That's about it. Inventor? She like she crosses her arms in a thinking pose. It takes her a moment because of the bickering the <laughs> these two in the background are causing her, and yes, that's Deborah. Oh you mean the one who just left and well for a while now. I think you might not have been too late. But, there could be something I could help you with. Creed looks up better. Are you... S- are Look, you still yeah. working... Uh, are you still doing mercenary works, may I ask? Every now and then, yeah. Hmm. Looks Beth, and then back to you, Creed. And then back to the Beth again. Mind if you guys help us with something we've had trouble with in this town? Then maybe I could help you find this inventor. Oh, yeah. I'll, 
I'd be, we'd be glad, glad to help. <laughs> Go get a tighter belt. <laughs> Go get a tighter belt. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> Let's sell this in our hideout. Not really. Now that's the spirit! <clears throat> it's not really that safe to talk here. Um, Arcus! Yes, ma'am! Uh, escort the rookies to our hideout. On it. And then he helps you up. And then kind of. gestures this way. Right this way, newbies. Oh. The hurried being Yeah, he was on Wait. Wait. <laughs> Hold mm -hmm. on. <laughs> okay, I just... Ah, fine, we can continue. <laughs> Dang. Ugh. Oh, fine. We can continue next time. These two get... Escorted. Come here. You said owe me a pint. <laughs> <laughs> right this and then she looks back to you guys right this way and also leads you to <laughs> the hideout in your dreams. And for context, this is actually how big the map is. Do, 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 do. Holy shit. Oh That's yes, so it's a very oh, big boy. map. Oh, that boy. Oh, boy. over here. Over here. Across some farmlands a bit. And there, are, there are villagers Bringing here us. and they're giving you... They're giving you, especially Creed, a weird look. Because of how how built you are with your armor and stuff. Can I, Until you can get I try here. to intimidate them? Me? Uh, <laughs> Wait. The normal ass... The normal ass check. control. <laughs> the normal you can roll an intimidation check. I want to ask... Miss DM man. Yes. Can I use less strength? <laughs> what? Intimidation. I mean, what, what, what would you use? What are you going to use it for? Because my... I could, I could use that. I could use strength to intimidate them. Just be, oh, look at me. I'm, I'm strong. How would you, uh... How would you intimidate them? Would you Okay, I have an idea. So there's this head cannon that I have for Creed. Is that whilst okay. he's while he's fighting, he a lot of heat. Mm -hmm. So the way he's gonna do that is he's just gonna he's just gonna open up his plates, and then you just see all this steam just kind of just kind of come out of him. So like a steampunk robot. So yeah. I'm so. And if you and if you did have intimidation, a really good intimidation roll, I have something good to reply. I guess do a <laughs> do a strength based intimidation and see how much steam you can emit. Nice. Let's okay. see what that would be. That'd be I... a plus five. Well, a little bit another one is just weaving. <laughs> Stella Beth also everyone. on your shoulder because yeah, she, yeah. she would get steamed from your heat a little bit. You feel like a brick You're gonna hurt a little bit? <laughs> nah. A little bit? nah, she's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's see how much steam is gonna emit from this uh, man. Did... Oh no. If I what? use the... <laughs> oh, no. If I use um, the fighter's might, that would be a plus 10 to intimidate. Oh, oh my god. I want to see the steam sail. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna use this. We won't use that. It'll be plus five. Alright. Alright. Oh, oh my god. Oh god. Oh my god. Starts starts emitting sure, more steam he's... than Every every nook and cranny in Creed's armor and just starts just that basically loads <laughs> its steam. Starts <laughs> and then starts emitting greenhouse gases or whatever. Yeah, the farmers they they step back a bit, kind of they are they are definitely intimidated and from the distance a little bit. Look, ma, it's a big scary uh monster person and he's on fire. <laughs> <laughs> What? <laughs> Just being friendly. 
friendly. <laughs> um, we'll, we'll work on it. <laughs> As if he was yeah, in a sauna, That's somewhat impressed. <laughs> <laughs> and starts hissing. Uh, I guess it would make sense for us to introduce you to um, Creed and Elizabeth, was it? Yeah, that's her name. That's me. Uh, these are our new recruits, Shadow and Layla. She gestures to these two. A little bit waves. Hi. Sweats. <laughs> the dude just sweats. Yes, I, in I, I indeed did a cat hiss. <laughs> <laughs> I, my mic cannot pick up me hissing. Ah. Give them both a look over. Right, just kind of just give them a look up and down. Uh, hello. Hi. Howdy. Wait. Howdy. <laughs> Howdy. 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 They're the new ones. Howdy, folks. Uh, oh, oh! You two were the one rolling a while ago, right? That's us. Yep. I think you did a good job. With a little more trading, really? you might be getting better. Mm -hmm. Well, three things are. We'll note on that. Thank you, uh, big random strange man. Yeah. Um, his name's Creed, and I'm Lilibet. Oh, uh, okay. nice to meet you too. Nice to meet you too. Mm. <laughs> Currently <laughs> intimidated <laughs> by Creed's height. How tall is Creed again? How tall is Creed again? Creed Eight? is seven foot five. Seven. Uh, and yeah. So and I'm small, yeah, you are four. you are more than a foot shorter than him. <laughs> I am 6'2", two. Two, if I recall, so not really a foot short. Let me look at this. You were 6'2". Just Layla see. just, so just stares you know, at just, the height just, difference. I, I, I just... Yeah. I would say Shadow just looks, looks up from, like, trying to angle his neck is really sort of, like, <laughs> upwards. <laughs> From the fucking size of this lad, absolute unit. Oh yep. Yeah. That's Tad. Creed, all right. Oh, he he is indeed a unit. <laughs> unit. Ab check out the absolute size of this lad. He's he's big. like not even just in height, but also in stature. He be he's yeah, fucking... I, I can tell that. I can, have I you seen this body? <laughs> I have, yes. It was hey. steaming. Now so, imagine steaming that. So hard. Uh, imagine that with a with a halfling on his shoulder. <laughs> with a half foot in his shoulder. Halfling, a half -foot. Oh, halfling. Yeah. Oh, okay. That's why. That's why Lilibeth is small because she's a halfling. Yeah, I just imagine. Turn his her daughter. Yeah, Aww. I think I'm a daughter. <laughs> A little girl, basically. Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. So I just Im uh, so yeah, I just imagined that an elf on the shelf on this guy. <laughs> an elf, elf on the shelf. On the shelf. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. Uh, uh, what should we do? I think something. I'm waiting for that. Oh, okay. I'm gonna read it. Oh, a little bit, a little bit so Look so at that really height. <laughs> Look so at that height. Dots. Holy shit. Good part. So, Good part. connecting the dots, we could possibly work with these people? Directed at Shadow. Okay. Um. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. Now that you say that, Miss Layla, quick thinking. I was actually hoping that these two would volunteer in our case right now oh. and you two as well well what could we possibly help with and then she pulls out pulls out like 
a sheet of paper that's been rolled. It's uh-huh. relatively long. And then it shows, all of you can see, it shows like multiple reports of the which has been reported to give very, very strange noises at night. But there seems to be no one living there, and that's why they want to investigate on it. We have this issue, it's been happening a lot more frequently this week. Up to the point where we've been getting multiple requests on dealing with it, even though we as mercenaries don't really assume noises in the mansion would be suspicious, but considering there's no one there, it seems worth to check out. You, she looks at you, uh, Creed. <clears throat> You've always been excellent in your previous job, so I figured you can help your fellow mercenaries in this one. You could always go for extra protection. Your little friend here also seems to be an adventurer, and if she's willing to help you, then the more the merrier. Give a look to the two cats. <laughs> yeah, so I'll be uh, working with the fuzzballs then. They're, they seem beginners, but they are indeed holding a lot of potential. So, I trust you can be, well, eh, what's the right term? A teacher for them, at, at least. Just for this short while. <laughs> well, you know what? Creed teaching the beginners. <laughs> Creed teaching the beginners. Just... Well, I think that's a great idea. <laughs> I mean, I'm I always think... glad to help. You know what? Um, she gives you a smile, little bit. <laughs> Dark, possibly haunted mansion? I am excited and terrified. I second that. I second <laughs> that. I second it. I second that. Let, we'll, let's go there. I, I'm down for it. Oh, and about the, about the high cleric you're looking for, she usually spends her time doing her priestess duties in her church, just about close by of here. But I saw her out on a small errand this morning, so you may want to check her church in the afternoon or night. That's, of course, after we've dealt with the mansion thing, which would eventually end at that hour, if I did my calculations correctly. That's when she's usually home, at least. Mm. Good to know. Least, thank you for telling us. Uh, she checks. There's like a wall clock here. She checks the time, says, Hmm, Marcus, how much time did we have left on the scouters in the mansion? They should be should be back any moment now, actually. Alright. Gather some horses for these four. They shall be on foot immediately. This man. Um, horse um, carry me. Um, I... <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, um... Um, we can just have three horses. I can ride with Creed. <laughs> you sure are you sure? Are you the horse? Can the horse mm. even? <laughs> no. <laughs> are you sure, ma'am? He will see you a little bit. <laughs> can the horse even? <laughs> oh, um, yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I'm sure. You don't know if she mentioned. You don't know if Deborah meant a carriage or something. She just said horse, but you'll never know. And Marcus does indeed whoop whoop swerve his way and into this yeah, carriage into might here. struggle a little bit. Yeah. I feel like I feel like that horse is gonna like. I feel I feel like the horse is gonna be built different for it. Built different. <laughs> Big <laughs> ass horse. Oh, yeah. There are horse. those kind of. <laughs> yeah, those shadow exist, actually. Shadow, shadow wanna race for it. Race first to the mansion. Um. Uh. Okay. Uh. Yeah. Horse draft, horse riding, capacity five forty, four eighty. Damn. Damn. Imagine uh, you just yeah. get Layla. <laughs> right, Layla. Um. Of course, Layla. Come on. <laughs> I sound too polite for this character. Uh. You just get these absolute units. <laughs> Be like, let's go! <laughs> and as you're 
after screaming, let's go! And you hear multiple neighs of horses. One that sounds very buff. Oh, and shit. Yeah. Oh, yeah, shit. <laughs> Debra, Debra, knows, Debra knows your unit crates, so she'd assume you'd need stronger horses to carry all in a carriage. Yes, and... horse. That horse better be fucking huge. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have tokens, so just imagine it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Like, four, I guess, two absolute units of horses with this carriage with the symbol of the mercenary just strolls out here. And oh, this is your ride. The and over. How to buff the is people this horse? here looks to the people in front of her. Uh, who is more confident in driving? Oh, one of us. Wait, who? Animals. Wait, let me see. <laughs> uh, we both don't drive. <laughs> I would assume we both don't drive because we live in, um, we live in the jungle. <laughs> well, um, you, you live in the I jungle, which means you might have nature. <laughs> I mean, that's true. <laughs> wait. Animal handling? Actually, wait, let me check. And animal handling. Uh, yeah. No, no, no. Well, you have to decide who drives first before you roll. Oh. Yeah. Uh, I have. Well, oh. I also have three. I have minus two in animal handling. Oh no, bro! Why is it minus two? Okay. Oh, it's because you have low whiz. That's why. Right. Yeah, I have low plus, also whiz. plus three. I'm sorry, whiz. Yeah. I also have plus three on animal handling. Yeah, I have two on animal handling. So it's Layla. All right. Is Layla oh driving? I'm, Do you I'm smelling ride? my just an OOC kind yeah, of thing right me. now. I'm smelling my dinner. And oh, who's hungry. who's riding in the front and who's riding in the carriage? Two people can sit in the front. I will be in the carriage, I suppose. I'm on feet okay. shoulder. Uh, so wherever I go, you go. <laughs> yep, you go. I go. Uh, <laughs> just I'm imagine, gonna... just imagine Shadow being right next to this hunkulus of a motherfucker. Just like. Did <laughs> just these two? I'm just imagining just these two, like the fact that the token right also to looked each up. other, being right. right next to each other. Uh, I'll be in the front. Yeah. All right, that's fair. Okay. The uh, carrier moved across <laughs> the front, <laughs> leaning sideways. Like <laughs> yeah, actually, uh, should I be in the carriage? Okay, so how does this work? Horses aren't my thing, but hey, learning experience. And then Marcus over here just gives you some pointers on like, don't pull too hard on the reins and be gentle with this. I do, do the thing I did with Ari's token, but in reverse. How do I do that? <laughs> <laughs> just make green bigger. <laughs> you go, if I remember, you go to... I forgot where you go. Yeah, the scroll, scroll wheel. wheel in the token. Menu. Yeah, double click it and then go to the last one. And then you. Yeah, next to portrait. Oh, okay, I see it. Oh, wait, oh, no, nope. You scroll too far, Creed. There you go. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Big <laughs> robot man. Look how that big works. he is now. I wish I... That works. Alright, uh, yeah. Okay, this yeah. is equal. Layla, Layla you're, you're given pointers like don't pull on the reins, don't yell on the horses, or else you'll scare, scare them. And essentially, just roll me a basic animal handling check. See how how well you are with driving horses in the carriage. Mm hmm, not dead. <laughs> Fuck, why do I don't it, have guidance? It's a, it's a slow it's like a slow pace. You're still getting used to the horses. They're getting used to the weight on the carriage. Like, it's a, it's a, they're bonding. They're not, they're not disagreeing with you. It's just, it definitely doesn't give you much wind in your face at least. <laughs> and mm. you, you four are given time to talk as you are strolling with the carriage. Hi. So how's the weather going? Debra also, Debra also just gives Creed a salute, or you three as a salute as you go away. I give her a small head. Nod. So what do y'all think of the weather today? I don't know. <laughs> oh, um... 
Well, I think the weather, uh, weather is lovely, and how about What's you two? What's the weather like? What's the weather like? What's the weather like, Druidcraft? It is, uh... It is cloudy with a chest of meatballs, JK. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, dear. It's partly, it's partly cloudy, I'd say, but there's still sunlight. I agree, mm. gonna say, it's annoying. Well, that... oh, I think it's I would have just, lovely. I would have just said, it's okay. <laughs> What is the humidity and temperature? What is the okay. humidity and the temperature? Haunted uh, mansion! The fucking... Totally not what terrified! Is the... What is the wind speed? So... Oh yeah, haunted mansion. So how do you feel about... So how do y'all... ...to that, this haunted mansion thing? Well... I'm not really um, affected by it. I got used to scary things. Creed's Looks gonna pat Creed. you. Okay. <laughs> Use the scary <laughs> things, flashbacks that happen. If there are ghosts, we beat the shit out of them. That's how it goes. I, I mean, how... if they're willing to talk, we can just talk it out. Can you even <laughs> I mean, just Shadow, Shadow, Shadow in his mind thinking, can you even beat ghosts in the ground? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, you two seem close. Do you know each other very well? Hmm? Oh, sorry, I wasn't listening. What? <laughs> you two seem close. Do you know each other well? Oh, uh, yeah, we're, yeah, we're, we've been, uh, we've been together for, like, a while now. We're cousins. Oh. oh, that's how you look the same. He's gonna, that's, that's, he's gonna give you a side eye. You've been together, and your cousins. <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't think they like... meant it. Like me. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, not in that way. <laughs> there's, there's a chew saying, time. "What the hell do you mean by that?" <laughs> next time. Okay. Oh. Uh, Leila, you can roll me another animal. Huh? See if oh, the horse right. is like. I, just, more. I don't have VC check. <laughs> uh, if you guys are now it, exiting the walls of Hammerhead. Better. It's a bit faster now. <laughs> they've they've got they've went from a walk to a trot now. Hmm. <gasps> nice. Nice. The horses are doing their best. They got yeah. they got this. I would say mm. she's oh, wow. the scaredy cat of the family. Okay, that's what the crazy gonna do. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull out a cup and start eating it. Cup? Yes, a cup. Crunch, a crunch, cup. crunch. You can just hear bashing of glass in Creed's mouth. And her, his terrifying mouth. Remember yeah. his terrifying terrifying mouth. The, the, these terrifying crushers in his mouth. <laughs> yeah. Beware, yeah, broken glass. <laughs> yeah, a little bit will just start strumming her guitar casually. Just uh, like a soft tune. Coming a bit while they ride. So, <laughs> well, once I finish eating the cup, you guys are obviously new to this. Yeah. Look at Creed wording. Often. Oh yeah, that's how he eats. That's how he eats. <laughs> Fun. He eats I... glass? Well, um, you can eat other things, but he likes- he really likes glass. Nods. I like the way it shatters. It reminds me of bone. You know what? I respect that. <laughs> <laughs> I should- I should also look to my nickname real quick, hold on. Uh... It... Ooh. 
There we go. Okay. You're gonna look at Layla. <laughs> oh, he Give me some hair. metal. I can eat that too. Uh, clog up anything inside him. He can eat it. Hmm. Lilibet has seen this so often, she's just so casual about it now. She's drumming her guitar. I'm trying to... I'm trying <laughs> to find that art of... that Johnny drew of Creed eating the cup. Oh, that. that. <laughs> uh, what did he say? I didn't catch it. As he asked. Reed said, give me something metal, I'll eat that too. Starts playing a Metallica rip, I don't know. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> he said, give me something metal and I'm just gonna play guitar, I don't know. No, oh yeah, wait, guitar. hold on a second. <laughs> no way, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But I do remember I have like... Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh... If you guys still have, or we could just fast travel at this point. Oh, that's um, true. They all have, like, Ozzy's typing. They all have, like, any Ozzy's other typing. Oh, Ozzy's typing. If y'all have any other, like, questions, that'd be cool. Let's, let's wait for what Ozzy is typing. Right. Speed. Uh, speed. I, speed. Okay, you're let's fast traveling. Speed. <laughs> okay, the uh, horse is now being used to Layla's commands. Go from a trot to gallop as you are now in a decently faster speed. The wind finally blows in your hair with the cruel breeze. <laughs> hair. And hair. Fur and hair. One with hair and then the other two with a lot of fur. And then we got metal hand over here. Metal hand. And you eventually, you eventually reach a stone path up ahead. Going uphill to where the abandoned mansion would be. And change your screens. Here you are. Alright, let's see this one. You see a lot of vegetation around, but these, what you see would be colorful plants, are just withered away now. And this arch is sea as hell. Jeez, this is drab. I mean, what that's what I expect. The clouds, the clouds, the clouds would have also been a lot more dimmer, making sunlight less visible here still light there's just no sunlight thought the weather would have been yeah. more sunnier yeah. it's sad to see that it's and abandoned you stop your carriage here and see the front porch of the mansion Oof. definitely looks abandoned it's like nice. rusty Imagine. rusty archway some barred windows with would this place could have been worse i mean very well built than you'd expected so very well built than you'd expect from an abandoned mansion and the gate the gate the door here does look like it's barred with wood and chains hmm. i wonder why it's abandoned read shrugs Oops. If it's the bitch, I think, who owns this place, I hope she... I'm gonna walk up to the entrance. <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna follow. Are you... Is, is Creed... Is Creed... Is Creed... Is the Lilibeth in your shoulder as well? It's up to Johnny. Uh, nah, for now she'll walk inside BD. Okay. Grabbing his hand, yeah. Size. Size is different. Oh, she'll what about the two cats? Hand. Uh, sorry, what? What about the two cats? Are you gonna follow? Um, we following we follow Creed while in astonishment of the building, with the size of the building. I don't know. I'll follow behind. I'll follow behind. Yeah. Ah, holding hands. Oh, yeah. oh. You you oh, you are greeted with a barred door. Where? Wait a it? second. Right here, the barred door. Uh, nothing, nothing, like, from your strength, Creed, you can, you can say you could easily pull the wood and the chain since they aren't properly wrapped anyway. Yeah. Just there for a keep, keep out kind of signal. 
Yeah, that's what we're going to do then. Who's going to do that? Then probably start eating the chains. <laughs> just, just bang, bang. Just throws the wood to the ground. Though. <laughs> and for you guys behind Layla being behind Creed directly you don't see what he's doing but you can see his arms flailing around a pile of wood almost hits your head as it hits the ground and then just crunches of metal drops to the floor <laughs> it's horrific grinding noise of the peace it's alright I'm gonna feel a bit rusty yeah. Mm. Well, I love these two. Now, <laughs> well, it's here now. A little bit. We'll take a peek inside. Okay. It take a peek and uh, it's it's not dim. Like you would expect an abandoned mansion to be dark and gloomy and dusty, which it is. But since it's still daytime, as dark. But still gloomy, and Aww. you see the main entrance. There's a stairway that leads to the second floor, and then a few doors. Mm. Good question. Mm. Is there anything that shows who owned this place? Like oh, yeah. A picture, portrait, portrait, or something? yeah, or names. Uh, in this yeah. area, not really, since it's more like an entrance more than a lounge, but. You can you see there are open doors here. Hmm. Okay. Hey. Let's go. Does uh, it uh, does it look like it's been tampered with recently? The, like is there like dust marks that are like you know when you like slide your hand on a uh, dusty uh -huh. surface and just like uh, you can roll like that? you can roll me a you can roll me a perception check. Ooh. Okay. Let's see. Perception. Um, get, get it on your shoulders. Get on your shoulders. No. <laughs> you can you can help her by putting her on your head. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that works. Why not? Uh, advantage then. Just give it. Oh wow. Nice. In this area specifically, nothing seems to be tampered with, as far as you can, you know. Mm. But with your height, you can also see more doors up here in the porch where the second floor is. Hmm. Mm. Well, it doesn't seem like anyone has been here recently, but there are some doors that are left open. She'll go what down. Does the party do? Uh, first, little bit will go down, back to the floor. Okay, climb, climb down. I'll help no, you the party. <laughs> Stop! We are not doing that again. Never. We've, I've learned this thing for two that. times. Two times now. Oh. I, uh, <laughs> both the times, Johnny has had a split the party situation. It's ended badly. It was very bad. Well, um, did, did she. Wait, did Deborah mention anywhere specific where the noises were? Did she? Um, she she did she she just based off as like it's it, within the mansion but she didn't really specify where. Um, All right, I'm gonna yeah. I'm gonna go to the first open door then. Well, with the left one or the right one? They're all open. They're all open. Not really mm. open open, but like the doors aren't fully closed. Like it's oh, it's a, okay. there's a gap a jar. Uh, mini mini mo there right go roll for it <laughs> that was that's what that, that what's a little bit does she goes mini mini mo <laughs> it's oh. it, 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 hmm. we're going Two. to the right one yeah yeah. Okay. Is everyone going? Yep. Yep, that's the right one. Okay. You make your way to the right one and the wood the wood the floor isn't wood at least, so you don't make any creaking noises. Aside from Creed whose whole met 
whose whole body is metal and joints and stuff. But you make your way here to the door. And you're met with a gallery room with clothes covered on top of every single place. This looks like trays, but just imagine it's like picture frames. Hey, it seems uh, whoever owned this left their things. Uh, look around for anything that might be helpful. Mm. Mm, you can roll a investigation or perception. Good, what are on uh, those things again? Just like clothes on top of... Uh, more like... it. See, they're square-ish. They look square-ish, but they're covered with cloth. Dusty cloth. Oh, so... well, you know, let's take off well, those cloths off those boxes. Yeah, okay. So, J- Lilibeth... <laughs> Lilibeth hops off of Creed's shoulder and just... Does little hops to reach the cloth from the table and... One, two, three, four. She pulls them all down. You get a lot of dust in your face, a little bit, and you kind of cough a bit because it's very, very dusty. And, and I guess Creed with your is everyone is anyone else rolling or is it just Creed? I'm a perception, right? Perception or investigation, whichever one is best for you. That's a 13 and a 14. <laughs> 12, 13, 14. 12, 13, 14. Uh, is Kaito here? I guess he can also I'm roll. If I'm wants. here, I'm here. Oh, no. oh, yeah. He's here, yeah. You can roll a perception or investigation. If your perception is Hold low, on, you can checking. choose investigation. Yeah. Uh, perception is zero and investigation. Oh, it's five. Okay. Ooh, I mean, Everyone got our good region. investigation in this party. God damn. <laughs> I don't remember why I had that time in investigation. Anyways, uh, roll uh, d20, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. And then yeah. plus five. Uh, mine is, yeah, investigation. <laughs> no <problem. laughs> Oh my I, god. I was wishing you would get a 15. Well, <laughs> uh, the, place is, the place is a bit too dusty. You can't really figure out what's on of these pa- uh, paintings, picture frames. I guess for for Layla, as you look around here, you look around here, create a little bit over here. Because of the sheer amount of dust, it's very hard to see what's behind the glass, but for you, I guess you can see a faint silhouette of four people in it, but you don't know who they are because it's so dusty. Mm. Looks to be two tall figures and two. No, they aren't coffins. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Two tall figures and two shorter ish figures. But that's about figures. it that you can. Can I, wipe, looking. can I wipe off the dust of the glass? To get a better... Picks up one, do a, picks do up a, one of the artifacts. Do a... Uh, okay. Actually, do a sleight of hand. Actually, See wait, how... What are, actually, what are these? Hold on again. What are these? They're like frames, but they're frames. very dusty. Frames. Oh, oh my god. Shit. Oh, wipe, wipe, wipe. Uh, Layla, use your furry... I mean, your gloves to wipe off the dust very, very gently so that you don't make it worse. Like when you smudge a smear on your shirt and then it goes, spreads even more. Oh, God. That kind of stuff. That worse. Yeah. And then, thanks, thanks to that, you can actually now see the four figures you see here are actually two adult elf looking uh, women with what looks to be young. Young people? One is a tiefling and the other is a. Uh. Where, where did I write those notes again? Oh, yeah, you can see that it looks like a family at least. Two adult women, elf, 
Elven women and Yeah, tief a tiefling and a human. That's not what I was gonna say. That's what you can get get out of. They once owned this place. Lesbians. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny's with her with her gay instincts kicking in. Gay? <laughs> Lesbians! <laughs> sorry, sorry. They were I focused on the wrong thing. <laughs> All I can think of now is they were roommates? They were roommates, they called each other wives, they never married a man and adopted two children. Oh my god, they were roommates. <laughs> Uh, Shadow, you look behind you, hearing what Layla says, and he, I guess, a lot, a lot, a lot less clearly than Layla, but you can see the two female figures and a tiefling and a human child. A tiefling and a human child, interesting. And is Creed and Lilibeth also gonna check as well, hearing what Layla said? Hearing what they yeah. said, oh yes, definitely. Okay, Creed, you can you look at the. Uh, the dusty frame, and with your eyes, they adjust, enhance, 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 and then you can clearly see who, <laughs> who those are. You can almost see Creed's eyes glow brighter. If he could smile, he would. I'm gonna take that <laughs> painting off the wall if, 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 if I can. I mean, you can. It's it's very. It's just left there. <laughs> Okay, nice. I'm gonna cast Shocking Grasp on it. Oh my god. What? <laughs> what are you what? gonna do? What? what are you doing? What, what, are you, what are you planning? I'm gonna take the painting, and then okay. I want to cast Shocking Grasp on it. It's simple, isn't it? Why? Plan. Why? I what want it, I want it like... broken. Why? Shocking Grasp is just thunder, not thunder, lightning damage. You can just, like, break it. You don't need to raise a spell. You can just... It's not a spell, it's a cantrip. <laughs> oh, it's a cantrip or Ooh. it's a cantrip, yeah. I mean Oh yeah, that's right. I, I don't you don't I don't think you really need to hit because you're holding it. I guess just roll me on d eight. <laughs> See how Why badly break? you scorched the frame? Is there Why is something, I don't think shocking grasp has mods, it's just a one d eight. Yeah. It's uh just a one d eight, yeah. And you block it? Shadow and Layla? No, Shadow and This is so homophobic. Uh, yes, it is. Yeah. Very much so. But what? That was oh, a one. <laughs> um the frame is now emitting like the friction kind of electricity. Shadow, since you're the closest, your fur kind of stands up during in close proximity to this thing. Okay, I'm just gonna snap you it feel like, and throw it on the You ground. feel like if you step one step closer, you're gonna get zapped. I don't. And I'm just gonna. I don't step one step closer. <laughs> I'm just gonna <laughs> just then see, break see. it, rip it up, and then throw it on the floor. <laughs> and then debris in the frames on the floor. I mean, that's. I think that's all you can see in this gallery, other than other. I hate these crime. ones are. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, sorry. These I are more. See, these yeah. ones here are more trophies and stuff, <laughs> but they're empty. Yeah, I feel so bad for that. Racket. Smh creed. I want to go and take a look at the rest of this shit. Staring homophobic. Okay. <laughs> Since Creed, since you know who the owner of this is, these are trophies of like her past inventions and looking through the other frames. And I take they the are indeed ones. they are indeed like similar to her. Until you go here, this corner, and then it's like eh. It's a chair, but like imagine it's a shocking chair. <laughs> a shocking chair. An electric chair. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I forgot the for the term. Yeah, it is an electric yeah, chair. Yeah. yeah, it is. I wanna. I guess uh, 
Wait, would I, know, would I know? Would I know what she she would look like? You know, does she? I mean, does does Creed tell you, her about what he he saw? Anything? Yeah, Creed would have told a little bit. I'll be right back. The woman in that painting looked like the description that Creed gave a little bit. Uh, a lot. It he it look older. But similar to the description, yes. I'll be a okay. for a bit. That yeah. When I'm back. Okay. yeah, for the rest of the time, a little bit will just hold Creed's hand. Squeezing it some uh, a bit. Yeah. Emotional support card. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I want to investigate that is... chair a bit closer, though. The chair? Okay. <laughs> I'll name you fish. There's the aquarium poised to one fish. I'll name you. Fish. The fish is dead because it hasn't <laughs> been tended to. <laughs> oh, it's amazing. Oh, so oh. oh. This is cute. Oh my god. Someone will die of fun. Oh god. Yeah. <laughs> Layla points to I... a fish that's belly up in the water. <laughs> I'll name you Dead Fish. Right, I want to. <laughs> I want to look at this chair. You can roll uh, an investigation. Okay, I'm good at those. I said that last time and I rolled dog shit. Watch me roll okay. shit again this time. Yeah. <laughs> it, def it doesn't look active at least. But there's no sign of anything that's... It doesn't look like it's been used for its intended purpose. Okay. But you don't know if this is active or not. It just looks static. I want to go around the room breaking random shit. <laughs> I see it out. We're not it out. Pretty, much, okay. no. pretty much breaking anything that looks important. That's pretty much it. Anything that, yeah. that doesn't okay. really remind me of her, I don't give a fuck. Anything that reminds me of what, her, I want broken. What's, what's everyone's reaction for Creed? Uh, throwing a tantrum, basically. Are you going to break the, the aquarium with the fish as well, even though they're dead? Do I still have? Nah. Unless I throw something at it, but uh, no. He won't break <laughs> Sorry, what was happening? Um, what was happening? Need is throwing a tantrum. Sort of. I, it's I just angry. Came back. What was it's, happening? It's an anger. Now. 600 pound up. robot <laughs> throws a tantrum. What are you gonna do about it? Uh, try it. Um, a little bit will just climb his shoulder. Try to climb his shoulder. Hoping not to get hit Wait, by the stuff he's throwing down. Why are you wrecking that place? This is our stuff. Oh no! Psh, psh, creep. <laughs> throws a wood. Throws a throws a picture frame over here. Hits the other one. It falls down. <laughs> breaks the chair in half. Breaks the floor. Throws a broken piece of the floor into the trophy, and then <laughs> a piece of wood flies out from behind you. Almost hits the aquarium, but it doesn't, and just poop lands on Layla's feet. Then I'm gonna finish by eating her. This is him around. <laughs> Chases him around. These two, I assume, are just like dumbfounded by this absolute unit wrecking the whole place. And you're gonna finish up by eating what? A trophy. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna finish by eating trophies. <laughs> yeah. As oh he comes God. down, as he comes down, a little bit will just climb his shoulder and. Uh, hug, uh, hug his head. That's... Yeah, a little bit will climb Creed's shoulder and like offer like comfort, like hugging oh. him. Mm. He leans his head in your direction. So I think this is uh, hers. Yep, this is her mm. place. All right. Hmm. These two, given no context to her, the her is. <laughs> I I just destroyed a random gay woman's room. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm Creed, just a and big homophobic robot. Yep, that's her. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Who exactly on here. her? Hmm. Um, a little bit. We'll look at Creed. You don't have to tell them. He shrugs. Wasn't planning on it. I'm gonna walk out the room. 
<laughs> just swoop passes by and you can see like there are still other doors open here in this left side if you choose to investigate the left side yeah it's a not? very long it's a very long room this looks this oh, looks like chair, chairs room. and chairs and a table but uh, imagine this is like uh it looks like a place you would train for. Train it's like for? uh imagine this table is like it's 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 the Harry Potter table hallway thing with the Oh yeah. Harry Potter, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> a pat a platform, there you go. I have a brain fart for a minute. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I think that makes sense. It looks empty at least. Doesn't look like anything of interest to you. Okay. Mm. Um Do as dusty as the other rooms. Yeah. Mm. I'm just gonna take a walk around the room. Look for anything else that might be important. Um, I would say I'm also. I would say I'm also. Like I would also say I'm in. I would also say I would be investigating around the room, like, but on the opposite way. Like, uh, yeah. I guess. Uh, who you can choose one person to every investigation. I have. I have good investigation. What? I have no will though. I have good investigation. Mm, I'll help. I'll help you. Uh, oh, oh shit! Wow. Oh wow. Um, yeah, this place is just empty. Like, it wouldn't really be a place for it to hang out since it's where people train, so. You see markings on the floor, but then realize they are your markings, so. Nothing much. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, same goes for these ones as well. You don't see anything. It's an empty, dusty room. There's nothing on the wall. Ah, uh, no, it's just like barb windows. Wait, does the barb is like from the inside or the outside? Uh, the outside. It's like when a house rents and then they cover it up. Oh, okay. Okay. But uh, from the front, you still you also remember there's like a pathway from. Up there. Bard. Barb. Barb. It's barbed. Barbed wire. <laughs> More barbed with it's wood. Been... Just wooden uh, planks. Oh, barred. Yeah. Oh, barred. <laughs> not not the barred. I just, <laughs> I just kind of thought the windows had barbed wire. Barbed wire. But yeah. It would take nothing. Okay, so what does any, what does everyone do since this room is empty? No, right, I'm just gonna oh. walk out then. Well, okay. Speaking of cool I'll walk out. Yes. I was just gonna like. break now. <laughs> oh, yeah. You see, you see, there's also a pathway here, and there are these doors look locked like they are barbed with wood but there's like a peephole there's a peephole at the top maybe that yeah. fuck the peephole can i break the door <laughs> yeah i just break the door <laughs> <laughs> roll, roll me roll me a strength check okay. for both doors all right so just two or one i i, I guess just I one on you're you're them. strong enough to break two at the same time i i put him on as i I, I okay, that'll be a plus five. Oh. Sixteen. Uh, <laughs> this 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 is an abandoned mansion. You you kick the door off its own hinges and into the. Wall. This one is a bathroom. You can clearly see it's a bathroom. Mm. This one here is a. Uh, this one here is a lounge. 
Like an extension to a lounge area with books and stuff. BRB nice. for business. Uh, Did you also break this door? Yes. Okay, so that door is also open and you can now see a very big living area with a piano. Damn. It's a piano. Walk through all the rooms that I've just broken into. Oh my god. Just look around. Okay, where does uh where does Kaito go? Because I assume Layla and Kaito just stick stick together. Okay, Layla and Kaito, Layla and Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> you go in the big room, Creed? Let's go in the big room. Well we wait for uh Kaito and Azi. Let's go for you guys. Yeah. This Hello. looks like Oh, oh, okay. I've yeah. been here, I'm sorry. Okay. I've been telling you that I wanted to go into lounge. Okay, lounge. Okay. okay. Your, mic so lounge mic be... kinda like... My mic is You're very like funky. Muted. My okay. mic was very let's, funky. Let's go, let's start with uh, Lecreed first. This is a big area. Like, it seems like... But it's more of an extension, really. Like, there's a harp here. A shape of a harp covered in cloth. A piano that's dusty and a few chairs here. There's also like there's one big couch revolving around here, but I just can't find a good reference for it. But yeah, the place is big. Very big. Mm -hmm. This is uh really extravagant. Hmm. Honestly, so. honestly this isn't what I thought when you told me what she did. I thought she would be like underground dungeon or something. Yes, Wait, did you have a... years, People change. Hmm. Hmm. We'll walk over to the piano. Oh, piano. 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 Yeah, piano. I'm you open the cover. You open the cover, just push, dust escapes oh. and. You kind of have to cover your mouth for a bit. I mean, if you if you touch if you push down a key, yeah, a little bit, you can actually hear a key. It works. Still makes an it still makes a sound. Yeah, a bit dull, but it still works. Still do a little, little tone. That's a simple one, short one. Yeah. Testing out the keys. Just the uh, ring. It's slightly out of tune, but actually still decent enough to make a song. Hmm. Does it look like it's been used a lot? They unravel. I'm kidding. <laughs> um, kind of. Looks like someone likes to play the piano most of the time. Nice. Green starts playing Rocket Man. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, Lenabet is like playing, playing a tune into the piano. Yeah, just a short one. Then after she'll play it, she'll look around the room for a bit. Plays a little okay. bit of chopsticks, I guess. <laughs> Roll me a oh, perception. Oh. If you are yeah, looking around, because this is a big area, so. Can roll another perception. That's a twelve. Roll another one. Oh, okay. Uh, the screen look or. <clears throat> Is Creed also rolling perception? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just trying to calculate bullshit. My perception is a plus three. Ah, oh, um. okay. <laughs> <laughs> Looking around, uh, you pull down this, you pull down the piece of cloth here, and you see a giant harp. There's chairs, couches, and then you see the big lounge area here. And then you look back to Creed to report like there's nothing much here and you notice something on his feet like uh 
Yeah, the floor is dusty enough that you can leave foot marks, but you examine Creed's foot and the markings on the ground he's standing on. It looks more like there are scratch marks from where he is, but they seem like it's from a moving object at least. It, you don't know, maybe they just arrange or something like that. But there has been signs of movement in the part. Oh, okay. Is the scratch marks like dusty as well? Is it the dust on it? Yeah, they, you can still see them very clearly. Oh. Where, like, like the couches were like in, in mood? Uh, from your perception and I guess your passive insight, just you would think it's from moving like they move something here at least is Azzy back or like oh, dead. Dead. yeah i'm still like, here like... yeah i'm gonna wait for Ozzy since you two are also yeah. there is it like a big like scratch or is it like a, like a small like little nudge it's slightly big Uh, 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 seems, uh, seems like something moved, but I don't think it's recent. She'll point at where she saw the sp little scratch marks. I'll look down at it. You look down, and yeah, it does seem like there's movement, like signs of movement. It's not. Does it, look, it doesn't look recent, does it? Yeah, there's still yeah, dust. No. Does it? Can we try to like replicate where it's like it was nudged or moved? The what? Can we like try to replicate where the the thing was like moved? Like try to like trace back the nudge, uh, the scratch. The thing. Uh, you, ch you try to like brush off the scratch mark. Oh, like where? there's the scratch mark came from the couch, right? Looks like it. Yeah. I'll try to move like the couch, like, like retracing its steps, right? Like you try to replay, uh, try to like copy where it's like scratch. Try to copy you... the movement of the couch. Or, uh, oh, okay. Yeah. So you try to like put put it back in place. Yeah. Yeah, you do that, and I mean it. It, it matches the the direction. Yeah. Nothing happens. Else? Not really. Hmm. Not in this room, from what you know. Nothing seems to happen. Okay. Okay. You went. The couch went from here to like a slight slanting here, but nothing really happened. Oh my God! Did you find anything, Reed? Didn't, didn't spawn nothing. Huh. Uh, this room seems more like a lounge or music area, I suppose. Where they sit around and play. Nothing too important. Uh, are you guys gonna uh, stay uh, here a bit or? Right. Uh, Keep looking around. I'm a, a little bit just ask Creed like, um, are you all right? How are you feeling since we, you know, entered here? Well, stop and turn to her. Not really sure. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I'm I'm here if you need me. Gives the nod. I know. She smells bad. You know it would be uh, fun. Uh, noises. Yeah. Oh, okay. 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 I you can uh finish first. Uh -huh. 
you know, it would be funny if those noises came from her ghost or something, right? Ghost song. Yeah, something like if it her is ghost, I hope it's hers. Well, it's, you know, the usual curse to haunt this place forever for past sins or something like that. Would be funny, yeah. Mm. Though I think I would get more joy if those noises were her. Mm. Well, we'll see he, when we'll see it. He shakes his head a bit. Oh, he he, he he can't really breathe. <laughs> like he's you you can tell what he's doing is like the equivalent of like a, a deep breath. Um, Dude, His chest just expands and retracts. <laughs> yeah, feel it closer and just squeeze his hand. Oh. Well, as much yeah, as much as. Maybe fingers, maybe a little bit too small. His fingers <laughs> fucking bad. He got some big ass hands. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, moving to the f the cat girls here. The furry. This area. Furry. Is she back? <laughs> Ozzy, are you alive, Ozzy? Ozzy. Z. Ozzy. It's Ozzy. been more than Ozzy. a bit, Ozzy. Ozzy, <laughs> please. <laughs> As he's returning back in two hours again. SMH, Ozzy. Well, I can at least tell you the description of this room. It's like... It's, it looks like a library kind of room. With a chair here. Yeah, these are more couches than library... The bleh, bookshelves. And imagine this is a... Uh... A small fireplace. And in this, in these chairs, there's actually like a few letters here. Is there scattered about? Okay, so there's no paintings or any sort of kind of thing. Like not really. These are more bookshelves. Yeah. So it's just honestly a library. I can like take. I can honestly like take like um what's it called? I guess a bit of a browse dr through all of the books. Uh, well, not all of it, just one side of the uh, bookshelves. Yeah. You can see that the books dusting away the the spines of the books, I think books are called spines. Yeah. You yeah, can see fine. various books about uh, mechanical work, inventions, and uh, school kind of books. Like, you know, you know architects, engineering books. Uh, school textbooks. Like Not really school textbooks, but it's like if you're studying for those kinds of jobs, you would read those kinds of books. I suppose it would be called textbooks, but yeah. Um, um, I guess um, in some way, I would also think uh, to also like investigate the fireplace. As you go here, actually, you can roll Roll what? Um, survival. Survival. Minus two. Uh oh. Oh my. No, no, it's good roll, good roll. Let's see. So I do just d20 minus two. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh wow. Ooh, not bad, not bad, not bad. It's actually so decent. Alright. You look at the fireplace. I'll elect retro. <laughs> you look at the fireplace and there's something you there's actually something you'd notice here. The fireplace it says that this mansion was abandoned, but you put your hand in just like dusting the webs and you notice that it's it's a lot huge here like it's warm you but not warm, warm enough for it to be recent like if the air here is cold the air here is like room ish temperature 
would that would that sort of say something like this was like lit recently or something? Not not recently, not... recently, but um, just yeah, something sort of like that. Distant time away, I guess. Um, all right, I would yeah. find that to be pretty in, in, informative. God, if someone lives in this mansion, in this abandoned mansion of two lesbians, um, let's see. <laughs> Um, can I invest? Can I investigate the lounge chair? Oh yeah, you can roll. All right. I don't know why I'd want to, but uh, investigation plus five, so that means d twenty. Roll. Uh, oh, one d twenty plus one five. Thirteen. <laughs> <laughs> and the letters it's not not really interesting most most of these are like complaint letters from the town mayor mentioning noise complaints but you can tell they letters. weren't open at all letters from the town mayor yeah like mentioning like noise complaints like how they're the seemingly owners of this place are disturbing the neighborhood at night with its Loud, right. weird noises. Right, you clean right. up the debris more and scraps. And you can see, like, hmm. There's one, one letter here that's not open, but it's from. It's from someone else with an initial of M on it. So there's it's like, a letter with it's like a fold of an M. Uh huh. Yeah. So what, it's like a letter so M. It, is there anything inside that letter? Or is that just the initial? Eh, you know, it's like it's a folded, it's a folded letter. So you haven't opened it yet. Oh, then I should open it. I, I open it. Okay. Yeah. You open it and it looks like an invitation. Uh huh. Oh. And let me hold on. Let me actually check something. Where the hell did I put it? It it, it should be here. You skim you skim through the the what looks to be invitation, and the it's it's old, like weird. The the ink seems to have faded away, but you can get the gist that it talks about some sort of party in a fancy place a bit far from Hammerhead. You can't really get the details that much because of how washed away the ink is. Mm -hmm. I would okay. I feel like I I can't think of anything to like investigate enough, so I guess I can like leave the lounge. Check the bathroom. <laughs> you check the bathroom. Yeah, why not? I, uh, I think I assume you just uh relate to Layla what you saw. It's like, whoa, this place is indeed weird and haunted and creepy. <laughs> you check the bathroom and you look at the debris of the broken door. Creed just broke down and it's a bathroom. Nothing much special here. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's true. I, I, I was gonna think. Wait a second. There's a door over there. Wait, is, is it's it... it's a it's a compartment of well stuff you would see in a bathroom. <laughs> towels, shampoos, bottles, soap. towels, I... shampoos, and women's Why... essentials. Women's yeah. essentials. <laughs> yeah, a whole room for that. I don't think it's I'm. It's a of lesbians. What do you expect? <laughs> fair, fair. Sorry, I'll get Mansion. It's a bit of mansion. SMH. SMH. <laughs> oh, where is Ozzy? <laughs> Ozzy's <laughs> fucking he, dead. He did the same thing in Force of the Laws. He like she said BRB and like wasn't there for the whole the whole session, like for like three <laughs> to two hours of it. She yeah, was I'm, not there. She, she, like, only, uh, she only appeared like the end of it, like near the boss fight. 
Uh, is everyone gonna uh, up or? I feel like, I feel like, we're, gonna, I feel like we're gonna have to like meet up. Yeah. Yeah. So everyone meets up back here at the hallway. Bop up. And you can talk for a bit, like relay you what you found. So did anyone find anything? Uh, oh, oh, she's oh, back! Oh, in, finally! <laughs> oh my gosh, she's back! For the mere mention of her. For God, for two years, years woman. Oh, Kaito, your mic is doing it. Uh, context for context to Azzy, you and Shadow were investigating this area. Sha Shadow found that the camp, the campfire, the fireplace here seems warm, but not warm enough that it's been recently used. They also found letters here, which is like noise complaints and stuff. Yeah. And then one specific letter that talked to an invitation to a party, but the ink was smudged too much that they couldn't find out who or what the party was. And you are now meeting back here just relaying the information. Um. Okay. So, um, yeah, I've so yeah, I've made the uh, discovery of both the uh, letters, an invitation letter, and maybe a lot of noise complaint letters in the lounge, as well as like, um, the, the fireplace. Fireplace seems kind of a bit warmer. Not not warm, maybe recent, but warm mm. compared to the whole atmosphere of this mansion, kind of thing. Uh, can I look at that invitation, if you don't mind? The invitation letter? Uh, sure. Um, I grab the- I grabbed the invitation letter and, um, sent it to, uh, uh, gave it to, uh, Lilibet, right? Yeah. Alright. You look at the- uh, You look at the invitation. Yeah, it's- the ink is faded away, it's like- it looks like the letter has been sent here not recently, but looking close to it, and I guess create can help you. Eh, it, the handwriting is fancy and stuff like that. And you look at the bottom, bottom right of the letter and you see an emblem of a mask. Oh, yep, 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 yep. And yeah, that's about all you can get. Yeah, also the emblem of the Master Creed. Doesn't this look kind of familiar? Hmm, I'll take a look at it. Yeah. Looks familiar. You might have been invited to the same Master Creed. Interesting. I'll take it and look at it. Mm -hmm. It's a shame. The place would have been a lot more fun if she was there. Well, I mean, uh, it really was a lot. But yeah, maybe we should explore more if to see if we find more things. You did, you, there is still a second floor, you guys remember? Yeah, Yeah, there is a second floor. I was thinking of, the, of checking that place out. Okay. So does Anything everyone else? go to the second floor? Yeah, well, yeah there is nothing else, yeah. Alrighty. Yeah, there's really not that much in this room. So you go to the second floor and just give me a moment. Shit. Eh! Second, oh my god. Where? Yo, Second floor, here we go. Rocket ship, silver <laughs> the sky. Okay. Uh, just imagine that these rooms don't exist. They're more balconies. The only oh. existing, the only existing ones is like there's a hallway here and. Mm, one big room that's that looks a lot firmer and not wood. And it's locked with 
like a steel lock, then there's a bedroom here. You can tell it's a bedroom because of how designed it looks. I wanna <laughs> still try to break the door. Creed okay, smash. Go. Creed, Creed smash. smash. Roll, roll a strength check. Uh, this one looks like it's firmer than the ones below at least. I, do it. I cheer on Creed <laughs> as usual. No. What? You made a dent on it, but it doesn't open. <laughs> Uh, uh, that's a shame. Strong enough to dent it at least. Wait, what? let me check my strength. I wanna actually. try. Are you gonna wanna... try it to... What? How How will you open a locked door? <laughs> Other than kick I... it open. Oh, never mind. <laughs> you have a rogue with you. Yeah, rogue. You're saying rogue. You wanna try to punch the door. <laughs> it's a locked the door. door I mean, and I, you I, have I, a rogue I... with you. <laughs> You know what? Creed I could punch just the door. I could punch, punch the door, door. and then started happens. heading towards the bedroom. What looks the, like the wait, bedroom. the door the door is just still locked. Right? Yeah. You can you can pick it. Yeah. You, you have keys to Alright. Right? Yeah, I think you could punch. Try. <laughs> I just okay, the roll me a strength check and <laughs> try to follow your your If she fails. Go and then I'll take the bat. <laughs> oh my god, yeah. Okay, do I have something? <laughs> take one point of damage as you hurt your face. Okay. Um, can the I The difference something? between you and me <laughs> is you're made of flesh. I am superior to you. <laughs> okay, can I try something? Can I try something? Okay. okay yeah. Um, since I'm lot. small, since I'm small, I'm gussy gussing my daggers are also small, so it maybe can fit through the lock. So I'm gonna try to pick it with a dagger. Oh my god! You can do that with the help of Shadow if he would like as well. Oh, dagger? I was just gonna yeah. head towards the bedroom. Oh, okay, you know, you. you know what? You know it. what this looks like? You know what this looks like? What? Lilibeth, a bard with her daggers, and Shadow, a rogue with their thieves' tools opening a door. Does that not ring any bells? <laughs> oh my god. Wait. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't get it. Wait. A I certain, uh, a certain big beast hand bard. <laughs> oh my god. An uh, accidental reference. Let's go. Huh. Iconic. But yeah, I, I kind of forgot I do have these tools. Yeah, I can open with the hat. Yeah, I'll, I'll let Someday you I'll be it. strong enough. Layla just mm -hmm. outs. Uh, yeah. uh, um, Shadow, roll me... What tools check, actually? It's like a... A set of hat. Wait, what is it again? Like, I'm a, wasn't I, it? Like, 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 of hand plus proficiency, if you have proficiency on thieves tools. I think. Is that right? I uh, is. I think it's a. Yeah, there are thieves schools. There you go. Set of. Yeah, set of tools. Small. Um. No, here we go. And a pair of pliers. Proficiency with these tools lets you add your frenzy that... bonus to any ability check used okay. to disarm or open locks. A bit or a bit. So... Or so, checks. if you sleight of hand, then you could add your proficiency to Just that see. again, I guess. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Since so this is lock hand. picking, yeah. since you're lock hand. picking a door, sleight of hand would work. Yeah. So, roll sleight of hand plus proficiency bonus, which would be your proficiency bonus would be I can't. It, Two at this I point. can't. I'm not used to codex. Proficiency is a 2 Where at level can... 4. It becomes yeah. 3 at level 5. I think, yeah, it does. Codex is uh, UI for a DM. It's confusing. Yeah. I'm not yeah, used yeah. to this yet. I think it'll just be dexterity. I found the I found the, I found the image. Oh my god. Uh, so dex is dexterity plus proficiency. Dex, dex plus your proficiency, so... Whatever your dex is, plus that. Like, uh, Shadow, roll me a dexterity check, and then add a plus two. With the help of Lilibeth, you also get advantage. 
Is Kaido here? Oh yeah, what? Roll me a dexterity yeah. check, plus two. Yeah, then you add, you get advantage. <laughs> yup, that's oh, right. My Critical is roll. Plus five and plus yeah, plus five, then you're yeah, proficiency. Yeah, plus five and then plus two. Seven. Then you add AD so, at the end. Okay, plus seven. Yeah. yeah, then AD at the end. For oh my two. gosh, I just saw the photo. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, you yeah, you can I'm roll twice because it's advantage. Plus seven. Mm. Yeah, plus seven. Okay. Twice. Oh wow. Four, and oh wow. Four. Well, uh, you don't. Well, okay. Oh, just see my following that image. Lilibeth is like helping you at the bottom with her dagger up there with your thieves tools and yeah, with your swift, swift and. Precise hands, you can creak open the door, and you look here at another big room. But this time, it looks like <coughs> looks like a workshop. Ignore the bed. <laughs> it looks like a workshop. Workshop. Yeah. I wanted to check out the other rooms before we went into this one, but okay. So you could just leave the door open and check the bedroom, I guess. Yeah. So, yeah. Or does Ozzy and Kaito wanna be here as well? I, I be interested in the second one. Like y'all can just uh, go. Huh? I'm sorry. Y'all can just go on, uh, go from other direction. But in the party, woo! woo. So oh Ozzy and definitely... uh, Leila and Shido will go. Shido, Shadow will go here. And then Likreed here in the bedroom. Okay. I just wants to look for anything that's breakable. <laughs> oh, is this a kid's room? You look break here, the wall, break and it. The wall, break the wall. <laughs> you find yourself in a children's bedroom. <laughs> like two beds, a play. Oh my an God. empty oh playground. My God. Um, I'm look around. Do you know she actually had the um, children? Or is this like uh, something that happened after? I think it's a fairly recent. Hmm. Yeah, looking back, Creed, you didn't really remember any mention kids yeah. in your time. Last time but I saw looking, ar it. looking around, uh, Little Beth, you opened this crate here and it's like abandoned toys from. You would assume the kids would play. And then over here, Creed is like nursery rhyme books, and then two small beds here. Huh. Well, with the things you told me about her, I wouldn't know if she'd be good with kids, but with how this room looks, they seem well taken care of. You never mm. really considered me a kid, so. Mm. But she still created you, right? I guess. But I was more of a tool. Mm. Just to oh. think to do her dirty work. Oh. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna keep looking around. In this uh -huh. room or in a different? I'll look around this room a little bit more. I'm gonna climb on uh, this time. I'm gonna climb on his shoulder. Okay, I'm gonna sit there, patting his head. Yeah. <laughs> Bald metal head. <laughs> you can roll, you can roll a base. Hmm? Base perception. Uh, perception. I roll two, why not? That would be a plus three for me. Mm hmm. Ooh! Ooh. His head is shiny? Yes, it is. His head is very yeah. shiny. Head shiny, yeah. It's, it's metal, what you expect. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, this is more like a nursery room. Nothing uh, threatening you would see in a children's room. Good. We'll leave then. Go and see if there's any other place we can check before we go into the... You go here and there's like... Uh, this place. Oops. This one looks more like an adult's bedroom at least. This is the lesbian's room. Lesbian's room. Only on one bed. Is gay. One gay. bed. Look around. Gay. Uh, in this section here. Let me yeah. actually. 
I mean, make a... Level. Just so you can see it. There. There's a there's a closet right there. Ooh, no huh? closet. Uh, <laughs> they're inside of it. I'm gonna break it. Closet? I'm sorry. Mark. I'm sorry. It's closet. So dumb. It's so dumb. Closet? <laughs> mark. I'm gonna peek into the closet. Peek into the closet, gay JK. <laughs> <laughs> you peek in and... Eh. It's... Hey, you lesbians, you here? Yo, that's <laughs> Hold on. Hold on. Let me just... Surprise, surprise, the two queens... The no, two women were the, here all along. The aura of, I'm kidding. The aura of gayness does not hide themselves inside the closet. <laughs> What's that? Open the closet and see lots of women's clothes and you can feel extreme gayness. <laughs> extreme gayness? <laughs> I just imagine like very fashionable, um, yes. old timey yes. women's clothes, basically. Mm, yes. that's, well, that's more like just very just... gender. <laughs> more like very clothes. Gender. Yep, They're more old, old clothes. Like if if you buy a new set of clothes and then you just don't use anymore. Hmm. Ah. Um, okay. Those kinds of old, that kind of old clothes. Yeah. Creed, you look behind you, and there's a picture frame of again the two adult women with their tiefling and human children. And grab the picture frame. Yeah. Break it again. It. <laughs> <laughs> nom nom nom. nom. Uh, while you're looking That's inside the cool. closet of gay little bed, you can just hear behind you. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, he must uh, be While you're me. actually sticking your head in here, roll oh, me no. a investigation. What? Inside the closet of gay. <laughs> 16. Gay you push through the clothes a bit, like move the dust. It's very dusty again, so uh, you might want to clean your clothes after you, you're done with this place. <laughs> but yeah. <laughs> Pushing, pushing the clothes out of the closet, and the hangers, and there's like a ripped piece of cloth taped to the back of the 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 wall of this. You pull it down, and there's a small hole. Ooh. Looks like looks like a keyhole. Ooh. Uh, he, I found nothing. I'm gonna go look. You, you can you have to duck down a bit because you're too tall for the closet. So you duck down inside, and like you see where she says there's a, a relatively small hole in the shape of a key. Okay. I think it needs a key. Does it really? I'm gonna start punching the wall. Y'all <laughs> 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 uh, really are on the second floor. Oh my it, god. Uh, it doesn't break. It sounds hollow. Uh, yep. yep, something's definitely on the other side. Punch it again. <laughs> punch, punch, punch. It just you can just it a little bit your ears will start to hurt with the echoing of the cabinet. Of the punch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go outside. So let, <laughs> let him do that. Yeah. Oops, yeah. Open your... Hold up, let Once green, I see that cook. it's not working, I'm just gonna leave. Let's look Creed around cook. for a key. Let Creed cook. That is one sturdy ass wall. As you're going here, <laughs> let's go to the the two cat girls. This is how Creed. Co I break cat all his girls. shit. That's how I. That's how I cope with it. I break everything. Um, Chad, Shadow and Layla, you go in this room, and there's a lot of stuff here. Over right. here, over here, in like this. This is a uh, empty space. There's a strange whiteboard with a strange whiteboard with faded equations, and in this table, whiteboard. scatters of okay. blueprints around. Okay. And then over here, there's a chair and an empty table, and in this corner actually is a mannequin with an an old, uh, worn out. I see, I see. 
Maybe I I don't mind like checking out the blueprints on the table. Uh, investigation. Okay. There. Hey. Yeah. If you uh, if you want to check out something, just feel free to say that you're rolling investigation. Yeah, I'd roll investigation yeah. for uh, blueprints okay. on the table. Okay. What does Layla do? Ah, uh, you you can roll now. I'll investigate the mannequin. Okay. Okay, Doki. This is how Creed copes with his mommy issues. <laughs> I just I keep just recently reading the VCs. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Like, He's gonna start looking oh. for a key. Um, it's uh, a worn out lab coat. You know, you don't really you don't really think a lab coat would hold that much information. It's an old coat. Plus, it's fire. an old coat. Alright. Oh my god. Are you oh my god. Searches <laughs> Search through, through its pocket. Shadow, the blueprints are way too complex for you to comprehend. You know what? That's accurate. Uh, <laughs> from what you can tell, I mean, they are blueprints with the drawings of a robot and human bodies-ish. Human bodies-ish, right. But you don't really know what they're for. Right. Layla, you reach inside their pockets and... E? It's like you small. You touch a small rectangular thingy. You pull it out, and there's actually an em an embedded embedded words of no embedded groups of letters, and it says, from what you can tell, like touching the the formation, feeling the letters, you can sense it says something about Professor S. Professor S. Uh, does that is does that fireplace exist or? Yeah, but it's like it's more empty than the one you found under. Investigate it if you want. Yeah, sure. I'll try to investigate. Okay. I will roll that dice now. Hold on. I'll decipher the writings on the whiteboard, okay. Hey. Oh, nice. Uh, wait, I don't think it was for, for... It was wait, was it investigation or was it survival? Uh in this one I'd say investigation so we're Alright, okay. For so, you yeah. are you Layla, roll me a uh okay. I was gonna say I was gonna say you can roll me either an insight or investigation, but Uh, let me yeah, you can re roll this. <laughs> Insight or right. investigation? Ooh. 18, okay. Ooh. 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 We both got really good luck. The writings on the whiteboard are more formulas and equations, and they look connected to the blueprints here, but as you look back and forth, like you grab one blueprint, examine it. You look at the whiteboard. It it's like if the blueprints are a foundation, the whiteboard's equations are the uh com calculating how it would work basically. Like the blueprint says, okay, we we're gonna do this and this, and then the whiteboard says, if we're gonna do that, we have to do this to make it do this and stuff like that. It's, it's, a. Uh... the blueprint is the base, the whiteboard is the experiment. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna, that's what I'm trying to say. Um, so is there anything, wait, picture. is there anything on the right sure. side of the room that I kind of forgot? I uh, know, it's, it's just a lounge area. Oh, just the lounge area. I can, I can probably wait. Um, there's like a table on the book there. I want to kind of like. Uh, I'm not sure if you're like trying to follow the whole pattern of the thing here. There's like I see a table with a book. Oh, this one. 
I mean, yeah. eh, you can take a you can take a glance and it's it's more. Yeah, I can. Take it's a another glance. it's another textbook. Ah. Uh. But yeah, what did you uh, roll for your thing? Uh, eighteen. Yeah, you reach into this campfire, trying to feel the the heat again. It feels colder at, at least. And then you reach up, touch the walls, go up here. And then the, as you reach on the roof of this uh, campfire, you feel a small slot inside and oh. a, a tiny a tiny compartment. You actually rolled you rolled exactly the DC for this. You you grab the thing and it looks like a, a small key. Oops, why did I why are you like this? Backflip. Oh, so. I died. <laughs> Like you ducked under. That's that, you ducked under. That was what. That, that, that's what that was. Yeah. 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 Found yourself a key. What that so key for is though you don't know. <laughs> well, you two Acquire don't know what the key is for. <laughs> Slowly takes the blooper with her for future reference. <laughs> um. I don't think I'll get anything from the books. I would just assume they're just like textbooks again. Yeah, so... they're, they're, they're just the same textbooks. Uh, maybe. Wait. Yeah, I feel like we can like meet by the halls. So you're gonna look for Creed in a little bit. Are you not yeah. gonna tell Layla about the key? <laughs> yeah, I can tell her about the key. I can tell her about the key on the way there. Hmm. How would Shadow like, look tell Layla? Like, sir, like, hey, look what I found, kind of thing. Uh, you found a key. I found a key. <laughs> what do you have? A key. No. No. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> you look. What? You look for the others. You go here. Find a children's Wait, room. No. They're not here. Oh, what? nice. Let's yeah. find the others. You go here, and Lilibeth oh, and hello. Creed. As you're like, as you're like examining the room, you can just, eh, hello. You can just hear the door open and sh hello. Hey, Sue, oh. did you find anything? Uh, I found this key. I'm immediately gonna hold out my hand. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually what you need. Oh really? All right. It tosses the key over. Grab it. I'll try not. You try to reach into the closet again. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Sh Shadow and Leila, you can just see Creed ducking under this closet with the key. You don't know what he's doing, but you hear you hear like what sounds like gears turning or. Ch -ch 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 and then the this floor like vibrates as zzz, zzz, the doors crack open. You're surprised to see this wooden stone-ish mansion have a very very technologically designed elevator. Hello <laughs> there. Yes. Damn. Ooh. Imagine for, uh, imagine for this place. Elevator. This space is this big. If you find an elevator, it's like that big. Ooh, I'm guessing it works. Yeah, yeah. I, I was, I try to like step in first. No one's just gonna yeah. question an elevator in the room. Who's <laughs> just gonna walk in because what well, this, what is this? I just walk in first to just check what this thing is. I guess. I'm gonna follow in speed. You go in this weird, this weird Hello, room, man. and then just the for definitely not a death trap. <laughs> Layla mm. and Shadow, you walk in and the don't really notice anything. A little bit as the moment Creed steps in, the elevator just sinks a bit. Oh, just because you're big. Shocks. I'm gonna jump. <laughs> No. No. Is there anything like buttons or sigil on the wall of this? No buttons, but you can see a. 
Above you. Above you. It's like, ah! No, don't jump! You can see, like, above you. It's like, jump shot, jump a small, shot. <laughs> a small lever thingy. Too high for you to reach, though. I'm gonna I'm a do grabby hands at you. Ah! Uh, uh oh. A piece. A piece. I'll do it. Just grabs it and then puts it over your shoulder. Then I'm gonna uh, try and reach Oops. for the red lever if I can. You reach the lever and it's a bit rusty. It's like it's tougher for you to pull down, but you eventually get just enough to push it back down and the doors close. And the lighting in the room dims up because there's there's no light in this elevator at all. You just see the and... faint glow of Reed's eyes. I'm gonna feel... pull out a torch. <laughs> the glow will oh. help. I'm gonna pull out a torch. Light it up in. Okay. Wait, let me check my inventory. Hold on. I. Hey, one torch is enough. I have a torch and I have a tinder box. Yeah. As you, uh, right. let's see. Hmm. As we go down the little, you, you we'll go from the elevator music. Uh, yeah. The elevator music. <laughs> you can feel, you can feel the room. You can feel the room shift as if it's moving somewhere. It feels like it's moving oh, yeah. down. And I'm also... uh, in just let's say it takes. It takes like 10 minutes to go down, and within that 10 minutes, Creed, you feel something pulling. You feel something pulling with your gears, and it's like uncomfortably turning inside, but you don't know what it is. Everyone can see like Creed's gears in his mechanical limbs just twist and turn, and it doesn't look like it's something he would do voluntarily. That doesn't seem normal. Uh, Pete, are you okay? How do I how do I feel, DM? <laughs> you feel things comfortable. Yeah, something is like tampering within yeah. your your. I don't know what. It's just something's something weird is messing with your your thingy inside. I'm just gonna. Look at myself. Something's fucking with me. It might you can them. roll me. The room is dimly lit, so anyone can roll an investigation, but it would be at a disadvantage because of how dark the room is. How about yeah. if we have dark vision, which I don't know if fucking no, Warforged do get dark vision. I don't think they do. I. I have a torch and tinder box. I can probably use those. Oh, okay. With uh, with the dark vision, then you can just roll. I don't. Do I a... Wait, 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 wait. Let me, let me, let me look. Maybe I did. Nothing. I I don't think so. At I'm least. Warforged. I don't. Let me see. Nothing's have dark vision, right? Uh. Do half rings get dark vision? Yeah. They get dark vision. Uh, I believe they do. I think I should afford to put that. Warforged don't get dark vision. Oh, wow. Ooh. Oh. I don't, wow. That doesn't make sense. At least not to me, it doesn't. Uh, I mean... Uh, I guess, I guess... Eh. Oh, no. Halflings don't get it either. Ooh. Okay. They're built for war and only war. You need to see in war. <laughs> you need to see in war is the. Oh wait, I have uh, dark Kaito, vision. Kaito, you I can roll vision. investigation as well. I have dark display. vision too. Okay, I would have disadvantage then. Ooh, that's oh, bad. okay. Uh, wait. Wow, roll with again? disadvantage. Damn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. No investigation. What do I roll? Right? Can I, do I, roll? I roll as well. Uh, this, only is more, this is more for them because it's okay. you feel it within you. It's not like you can look inside yourself. <laughs> I just wanted to. <laughs> what? What? How much do? What do I roll for? Investigation. Uh, just normal investigation. investigation. 
the disadvantage. Okay. Unless uh, you have dude. night eyes. No, he has dark vision as well, so... Ah, <laughs> go fuck yourself. Up. It's only a little bit noticed. <laughs> I mean, fitting. It's fitting. Mm-hmm. Nice. Go <laughs> who, who rolled the 17? Is it Lilibet? Yeah. Lilibet. I rolled a 7. Okay. <laughs> Lilibet, for you, since you're you're on top of get Creed, on the Creed and you're kind Lilibet, of... get in the fucking robot shit. No. <laughs> you, you climb down Creed a bit, worrying, worrying about your friend, and examine his arm, his hands, his wrists. Just parts where you think the armor would have an uh, opening for the gears to shift. And you notice something very, very familiar. You feel like <gasps> the the metallic joints feel like there's brushes of something like hair appearing. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. <laughs> and... Um, it's 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 a lot more worrying now for you. Ominous music place. Very good timing, actually. <laughs> oh me. <laughs> All right. Uh, what do we have to do? All right. What happened? Sorry. Little Beth finds lo- small tufts of fur on his gears. Ah. Uh, Johnny uh, muted. Okay. Oh uh, no. Fur. Fur, yes. Prob- Sorry, probably. Oogie. Probably be. <laughs> nah, no. Just, is it not one? Uh, is it not like Shadow or Layla's fur or anything? No, it's on Creed's joints. Oh, it's on Creed's joints. All right. Okay, back. Okay. Stank ass fur is getting in my gears. You fucking <laughs> furry ass people. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We we'll give you. I'm sorry for giving you dan. Uh, uh, fuck, what was it called? Dandruff? Dandry? What? Okay. Uh, I'm back. Uh, wow. <laughs> it's not shedding yet. season yet. Every season is shedding season for any animal. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. It's kind of weird for you a little bit. Uh, yeah, we can't hear wow. you. Okay, there, there you go. You are. Okay, it's there kind of weird for you a little bit since it is still day- daytime. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, feed. Um, it's uh, it's happening, which is uh weird because it's still daytime. Did I die? No, you're good. Snow is I'm, not. I'm right. There. I'm right here. <laughs> I'm gonna Wait. look down at my arm. It's not a lot. Just like it's starting to grow ish. They're still small, like tiny, tiny tufts. Shadow tries to like get a sense of the. Tries to like feel the surroundings. I guess. You're you're in a compact room. It's not much other than big robot man covering most of the space. Ah, fair. Maybe it's. Uh, possible. if Lilibet, if Lilibet points it out, then you can all see. You can notice that Creed is actually growing a bit of hair on his joints, which is weird for ha. a Warforged. <laughs> one of us. One of us. One of us. Oh. <laughs> He becomes a big bara furry dude. Never mind. Uh, okay. Oh <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm gonna fucking slap you. Not really. Creed's gonna. Uh, okay. Gr- Creed's gonna grab your hand, and it's not a gentle grab either. Don't fucking touch me. Okay. Um, uh, hmm, what could we do in this maybe, situation? Um, maybe it's better to if we like, stay calm. You know how it usually um 
it usually affects when you're, oh, you know, maybe think <sighs> calm is better. Uh huh. You know what she, you know what she might be right. That's how he calms down. You know what she might be <laughs> what? right. I feel like he's gonna pet little bit because that's how he calms down. <laughs> Emotional support. Yes. Uh, Emotional you know support what? halfway. What does what does what does, sh what does Shadow say? We should calm down. We should calm down. Yeah, I agree with little bit. As I'm your, sure. I, uh, I'm sorry. Never mind. Okay. Oh, you go, you go, you go. You can go. No, 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 no. It's fine. I got nothing to say. I got nothing to okay. add. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. As you're uh, assessing the creed, you feel the elevator go into a stop, and then the doors open again, and you find yourselves in a different room. A lot. It looks very different from the room you found in the mansion. It looks like something a scientist would live in, with one large desk at the left with blueprints of, again, humans, animals, and robots. And in front, plastered on the wall, as you all exit the elevator and look at it, it... So Creed, it's familiar to you as in one of her inventions, but this one's new. It mentions a cyborg project. And on the on the on the desk with the blueprints you also see a letter written in fancy writing and in in Elvish language. Ah, the, I speak Elvish. It looks like a message from uh stranger this inventor would have known with again a stamped emblem of a mask wanna read it does anyone else speak elvish no uh, <laughs> i know i do wait actually wait actually wait let me check um hold on i i remember from like making my uh Zayla uh, does Mm, let's see here. It's so difficult to like read this sometimes. Yeah, I don't think I can see it. I don't think I could. I know. Wait, nope. Wait, I found it. Proficiency, Elvish. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay, so well, I guess if Creed chooses to read it out loud or not, then... uh... it's it's a letter. Properly written one this time that you can read fairly decently, and it says, <clears throat> "It says, my lovely Professor S, I must say that engineer with these blueprints and your wonderful creations have proven useful here in Ibrido, despite on escaping. But I made sure to put an end to him before he does anything rash. Here is my payment for your help." And I hope to work on that other event we plan in the future. Yours truly, Prospero Marquis de Machera. P.S. I do hope you can join the masquerade if you can. It's going to be eventful. And then, that's it. Mm. I knew it. We just okay. nod. It's him, I knew it. Before. Just nods his head while reading it. <clears throat> okay. Oh, and also, this room is dimly lit. Nice. Right. Yeah, you can read the name. Again, I can still try to, like, light a torch, maybe. I still have it. Yeah. Yeah, I, You I just choose to light a torch and then gives gives off a yellowish uh, tint to your vision. Right. At least... At least the way is now kind of brighter. Mm. Um. And actually, as you light up the room, it looks it it doesn't look clear. Like 
it's not dust, but it's more it's not mist either, like wet mist. But you see it revolve around you guys and create make a con save. Oh yay! Kind of uh, I'm kind of okay. imagining the upside down dust save. dandruff environment. <laughs> I have a dandruff. good concept, but I've been rolling dog shit this session, so let's oh, see. Please, please. Oh, please. Okay. Oh, you're you, turn. You've, you've, you noticed your vision getting a bit disoriented, but you pull yourself through and notice indeed that the mist has been messing with your head for a bit, but you gain composure. Maybe. And also, you also find with which you find a light switch right there next to the wall. Let's use the, let's do that then. Let's switch you flick the light that. switch. You flick the light switch, and then all of a sudden, just <laughs> sounds of. Electricity whirring through, lights turn off one by one, ch -ch 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 -ch. and then the room is actually very, very big than what you would have expected. You look around, behind you is a big table with belts, and then there's like an orb above it, uh, dangerously emitting electricity, like Frankenstein shit. No. You look, ar yeah. and also four tubes with purple-ish liquid. One of them being broken, but uh, investigating one of them, you it's it's a very not so. It's not a pleasant sight, especially for most of you guys who haven't seen these yet. One of the incubators inside has a humanoid body with robotic limbs. One, a large direwolf also with robotic limbs. The third, a bird-like winged, tall furry creature with a scaly tail wrapping around itself. The fourth one, broken, so you don't know where that led to. Uh -oh. And you are eventually m met with... With this place. Ooh. This is where you were, and yeah. Okay. Now that the room has been lit, clearly you can see. All right, I guess I'm gonna not use the torch. Yeah, you can snuff it. <laughs> no more torch. No, no more torch. Uh, okay. Uh, how do we oh. investigate this place? Shake seven year two flashbacks. Okay. I guess I guess I Oh and I forgot I forgot I forgot to mention there's also hanging above the ceiling is like two metallic arms that were broken. I roam around look around looking around the surroundings and my gosh I can't parse. I'm gonna yeah. uh, walk up to the, the containers. I wanna look at those. Mm -hmm. This one is the one that was broken. Maybe I'll try to Shadow. look at the containers, not the ones that were broken, though. Shadow, you look at the, the dire wolf, and it's like filled with purple-ish liquid, and there's like tubes sticking into them, but as you observe, they don't seem to be working, actually. It's like... It's like they... They failed to give this any sort of functionality. Like, it's limp. Doesn't seem like it's alive. Same same also for the the humanoid that you see, Layla. Uh, is there any, like, templates or names on... Deface them? Um, I guess, yeah. Like, at the bottom where you see this metal metallic stands this one oh, says okay. this one says prior wait, prototype number two uh dire wolf cyborg this one says prototype one failed humanoid cyborg this one says to be test uh hybrid 
creature. This one, the claw, you can see very clearly see claw marks scratching. It even scratched the nameplate. You don't know what so this could have been. To the, the claws that were in the other room? Or can we not tell? You can roll a insight. Mm -hmm. I'm a help. I use a flat d20. It's helping. Yeah. Uh, uh, 14. 14. Eh, they look similar, but you're not sure if it is the exact one. <sighs> Alright. Uh, so, I guess this is what he's been doing. Yeah. He's been busy. Hmm. Even use a person. Hmm. What if I asked? Uh, hmm? What if I asked? What if I asked Freed for some sort of explanation as to what's going on? Because I you seem can to notice I mean, that you can. I seem to like says, talking is talking is for free. You can role play your character. All right. So, yeah. I, I seem I seem I seem to notice that Freed knows what's happened. He does seem like extremely like this. It this here doesn't really phase him. It's like oh, this is just this is just normal everyday mom right here. Yeah. Oh no. She's a weirdo. <laughs> 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 oh, you know, casual mom stuff. Uh, y you've been incubated in a tube. I have too. <laughs> so yeah, how does everyone converse with each other with this? Just gonna just walk around and just look at the tubes. Your pee baby. Mm. As he is typing. As he is yeah. typing. A little bit I just kind of like a little bit like tries to look at it, but doesn't and just averts. Are around. there any other traces of escape from the broken? You can roll me a perception. But yeah, how does? Does anyone speak up on what they've seen, or...? Speak up of... Who's they... Ozzy? Uh, Ozzy has just rolled dog shit this entire session. I am my so god. sorry for you. What the... <laughs> mm. Talk for a bit, if you want. Yeah. You're gonna lightly tap the, the tube. I might, need, I, I might need to go soon. Oof. Oh. Ooh, ooh. It's fine. Nah, wait. We could try to, like, make this feel more complete. Hold on. But, yeah. Mm. Just nods at it. Nods. Goes up the creed and a little bit. What is this place? Well, uh, I would be lying if I said I didn't have a clue. Seems she was working on others. Well, I mean, there's a creation in blueprints upstairs, and there's this space, so you might, um, Put things together on your own. Doesn't I don't have. Okay. Mm. Might as fucking well. Why not? Bitch who lived in this house was my creator. She made me, and I want her dead. That's the short of it. Come <clears throat> here. Man, yeah. really leaning into the kill your gaze trope, I guess. Uh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's gonna kill both the gays. Birdie your gaze, people. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Oh gosh. Oh dear. Oh lord. 
Yeah. One, One shot title. Creed deals, deals with mommy, mommy issues. issues <laughs> taking care of three children. <laughs> I'm oh gonna point God. to like the the tubes running through me that have like the purple liquid and point to that. If you couldn't tell, there's a connection. I I I would sort of I would sort no nah, never mind. I I was gonna like ask about something, but uh, I don't think it's important to get. Speaking of it's Mr. Really, arm. It's a really oh. hairy uh, forge. Creed, roll me another concept. Uh, bro. Uh, Please don't. What if bro. I choose to fail? Madame. I'm already <laughs> hold person. I'm a, I'm already hold person just in case. I mean you don't you, it's not really what you're thinking of since the fur isn't vast or it's not fast. It's more of your senses, really. What? I wanna know I wanna see what this does. Bro, stop don't fuck around. I don't, don't wanna, wanna I kinda out. just wanna choose to fix. <laughs> you know what don't happens when you fuck around. You find out. Fuck around. Out. <laughs> find out. Fuck around. Yeah. Do it. On your shoulder, remember? I okay, well, I'll, I'll roll. I'll roll, <laughs> why not? Okay. We do I'm it, and we, and we are gonna find out. Oh Fuck my you. goodness gracious! Okay. That's bullshit. I don't want. I don't want to. I don't want to succeed, <laughs> though. That's the thing. I. Well, I mean, I retro want to see what happens. One thing. One thing you you do know from your past travels is that it doesn't work on daytime at least. Even though there are urges, they are more just urges. But this one was actually. It's it's the mist around you guys. You see this fog in the map. Mm -hmm. It, little Beth, you can clearly notice that it's doing something with Creed, but Creed is very resilient because, of course, he is. And yeah. you Wait, try to find the source of the fog, yeah, like where it is. You I look up and see, you look up and see a chandelier with can <laughs> candles, but instead of candles lit on fire. Are in oh, my goodness, oh. Retro, stop. You're wasting all the good rolls. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, one uh, more, one yeah, more. Can... Okay, that's a normal one. Look what you oh did. My God. Look what you did. Uh, what, 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 where was it again? The candle, candeliers. Yeah, instead of candles in the chandelier being lit with fire, I'm choosing the they're covered, okay. they're covered in a globe which <laughs> the small. <laughs> the smoke from the the candle is the source of the fog and the mist, and you don't know what's going on, but it's affecting Creed. It's only affecting Creed, that's for sure. Like I'm trying to like, like on the. Are they? <laughs> are Can I use that for the next con them? save? Uh, DM. <laughs> That nat one. That that nat one's <laughs> my next con save. Okay, just as so so whatever happens. <laughs> Okay. Whatever, whatever happens, just just say it fails. Thank you. Okay. Those <laughs> <laughs> you can't reach them, right? You How big is that chandelier? chandelier? This small, uh, tiny. Oh. Can we reach them? Nope, it's very high up on the ceiling. Well, can I shoot it? You you can you can try. Just roll an attack roll. Do it. Huh? do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Twenty. Okay. Oh, with your shot. with with your expertise in the bow and the arrow, you can you aim at the you aim at Wait, the. Wait, I I I, I want to ask. Uh, how yes. high are they? The the chandeliers. Ah, uh, it. I guess. Uh, more than 30 feet up? Okay. Uh, it's a tall uh, room. So. Smash. What are you thinking? Being a rules lawyer out this bitch. Short bows have a range of eight of 80 feet. So if, if it's beyond that, it's disadvantage. I don't... <laughs> oh, you have a long bow. Oh yeah, you're a ranger. You're not a rogue. Okay, you're fine then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she she rolled a twenty. 
Ah, yeah. I was gonna say, yeah. like, your arrow hits the chain holding the chandelier and it um, shakes the chandelier a bit to the point where it slips off the hook and trashes here in the middle and the fog doesn't go away since you're I in a room, hard, but it hard. stops it stops getting thicker and thicker, but you hear this chandelier crash on the ground and it the sound echoes loudly around the room and it it, it feels face. uneasy for all of you. If you want you can uh if anyone can roll a perception check, only one of you. I oh I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Mm-hmm. Okay. Don't you have a minus in perception? No, let me, Wait, let me check. Oh, yeah, okay. no, I have plus zero in perception. Thank you. I've plus just zero. been doing dog, bat, crazy, insane rolls for some reason. <laughs> wow, Creed, wow. Uh, a 22 is enough, yeah. As the... As the echoing of... The, the chandelier falling to the ground quiets down. Something else can be heard. You hear from from this area, like where the globe is, and also from here outside. Oh, no, not outside. This is a this is underground. It's not outside. just within this wall. You hear here like a a deep, deep, low, muffled growling, and over here. Zzz, 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 zzz. The, the the vision you look here and it looks like distorted until you see uh it it wasn't actually a globe the shape deforms itself and turns into <coughs> turns into a large humanoid thing and then in the wall psh, jush, jush, just loud banging from the other side and you hear hear a um like a, a very deep growl. And well, with one more bang and everyone trying to think about what to do, Creed, you can hear a draconic sounding roar and robotic limbs moving. As this turns into a a large humanoid cyborg creature, and over here bursting through the door. Throwing rock debris everywhere is a large lion like figure with a scorpion tail and. Scary. Well, e... roll initiative. Roll oh, Jesus. Uh, well, flat d20 for that. Ooh. 13. Wait, not council room RP. No. Not council room RP. <laughs> Uh, initiative, right? Hold yeah. Yes. Yeah. Just your. I just need to look for it. Your dex, dex. Yeah. dex. Okay. Yeah, just your dex. Uh, plus five. Okay. That's some initiative. Yeah. Bro. And give me a moment as I grab that. Give me a moment. Oh, initiative. That's three. What did? What did your initiative be? Five. Because you have a wait. The five what's is your, the saving your... throw for dexterity. Ah, so you have Ability okay. Has... So yeah, you have well. three. Okay, I thought you had, I thought you had twenty decks. You have sixteen. Yeah, I do have sixteen. Um, hold on, I'm grabbing it. Um, roll plus three, right? Yeah, d twenty plus three. Awesome. <laughs> That's good. We all, Let me we unhide all this one. Stuff. Unhide this one. Time to die. <laughs> Open some stuff. Where's my notes? Here. And the one that looks like a cyborg has its direction or vision targeted straight to Creed. And then you see this lion like <laughs> you see this lion like figure growling ferociously and yep, here it is. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alright. Okay. Let me snap you guys to the grid. 
Oh, we like this. We like, we love what's this. Your, what's your initiative? We do this. No, we don't. Shut up. I rolled a 13. A 15 for me. Oh. You and Kaito rolled the same thing. Yeah, me and we did. Who has the Ooh. higher deck? Oh wait, we both have. They uh, have Layla. the same decks. Layla. 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 What's Creed? Layla. What is Creed's uh, initiative? Thirteen. I have a thirteen. Uh... Layla Beth. Fifteen. We me and Kaito rolled the same. Rollies. Fifteen. Yeah. Uh, the rollies. <laughs> yeah, rollies. We're rollies. Eight. Both of you just roll a d20. Rolling, 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 rolling. Layla is uh, an eight. Okay. It's also 15. Uh, Shadow just rolled a flat d20. Okay. Uh, Layla rolled a flat d20. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Okay. I guess I go first. A little bit uh, first. Who goes first between uh, Lilibeth and... Lilibeth. Yeah. Okay, Lilibeth. Up, 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 up. Let's see, this one. 13. 13 for you. And then the Manticore. Plus three. Eighteen. Uh right. What's your as what's as your dex? Oh, Ozzy has the same. Same, very same. Rolly. <laughs> My dex. Rolly uh... again. Rollies for Layla and the, <laughs> the Manticore. Yeah. Oh, That's an eight. <laughs> I bet. Oh my god. That's a three. <laughs> well, who I wants to bet I wasted all my luck trying to roll bad for a con save? I do. Okay, so Lilibeth goes first luck. before Shadow, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, and then that stuff, and then. Um, yeah. Right in front of you is a large manticore accompanied by what looks like a dragon forge. Cyborg. Oh. Oh. And Layla, it's your turn. Ranger, go do your thing. What do you do? Let me check my weapons. <laughs> I'm gonna check my weapons. Hold on. This, if anyone watched okay. the movie, you'd know exactly what this manticore is. Uh, specifically. I, I want to ask for the purpose of Ozzy's subclass. Is the room dark? It's dimly lit, yeah. Okay, so it's not pitch black. Okay, just wanted to ask. Yeah, there are lights on, so... Okay. <laughs> I will shoot the manticore. I mean, it, environment can be... Uh, environment can be used, so... It would be a murder. <laughs> yeah, it's it true. This would not be a combat. Committing murder. Uh, roll to oh, yeah. hit the man. By the way, Ozzy. Just wanted to let you know you could have. Wait, did you do it? Giving it. yourself a bonus to your initiative mod equal to your wisdom. Where is. Here it is. Yeah, <laughs> it's Dread Ambusher. <laughs> oh, Dread Ambusher. Yep. Oh. Uh, did I die? No, you're or here. Did I the, think everyone. I think the, the bot music... died. The bot yeah. said. Uh, oh, the bot didn't loop. That's why. Oh, five. 
if Azu, yeah, then you would right. have uh, 21 to initiative. Yes. Go first. Yeah. So I guess this doesn't change much. You're going first anyway. I EP. You're Did you roll to hit Ozzy anyway. or? All right, an HP bars. Eighteen. Is that that a hit? Yes. Okay, you hit. Okay. You shoot an arrow oh, yeah. right into this manticore shoulder, and it it looks at you, baring its teeth, and oh, yeah, at the oh, <laughs> look at you! Look at you being cruel, lawyer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Increases by 10 feet, which lasts until the end of that. Oh, okay. This is the Gloom Stalker, right? Yep. Half your entire subclass is based on being first. Well, good thing you're the first. <laughs> yep. That's 6 damage. Damn it. Plus your pod. <laughs> All right, macros. Just put that under there. Also, you gotta roll for that attack, Ozzy. You gotta roll for the additional attack. So this manticore takes six damage. That's the wrong pat. This is it. Okay. If you take the attack action on that turn, you can... So it'd be 12 damage. No, 6 plus mod. Whatever your mod is. So which I think would be 9. So how much damage did she do? She did nine, I believe. Assuming her eight. Yeah, no, eight. Okay, so just add. Okay, so you you shoot you shoot an arrow into this manticore's shoulder, and it looks at the arrow and looks at you and just growls viciously. Does the rock eyebrow raise at you? Does the rock eyebrow raise? Oh. Hmm. Did you add it to a target? <laughs> this art, this art for the cyborg is. It is cool. Yeah. Yeah. It is. Too bad I'm a fucking murder it. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. So is that Azzy's turn or? Yeah, you have a bonus action. Wait, I'm so confused because the mod is not showing in the thing in Codex. Uh, if it's What's damage that? mod, then it's just your. Ability score mod. Yeah. Yeah. Codex is fucking weird. <laughs> An auto add the the mod for oh, damage. Yeah. So like an archery so plus. It's, it's five? So five. So that's six. So that's like eleven. Uh. 
11 damage, okay. That was 8 damage. Let's just add 3 more. Oh wait, not 11. So yeah, 6, 8, 11, okay. <gasps> That's your action. You got any bonus action? And that's it, okay. Uh, Manticore's turn. It definitely looks very, 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 very hostile and out of blood. It will bend down, and you can see this large scorpion like tail start to grow longer. And aims it, aims it at the one who hit them first. This one's going to you a little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Huh? I know, not a little bit. <laughs> Too many L Oh wait, Hunter's Mark thing. Yeah, you got that one. Yeah, one of that. Nice. Um... What's... What's that? <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that I assume so that hits close. you. <laughs> that was so close to being a 20. Oh my god. You get you, Lay, Layla. You can just see this large, like, bungee. Fan, you did take on you. Take, oh my god, 11 damage as well. <laughs> and it will move. Actually, it will move here. They don't need their officer. In the. There. Actually, no. Oh. Just stay there. It will hold back for now and. Actually, wait. Will it. Let's... Okay. Well, it decides to be a bitch and also go with Shadow. <laughs> or was they again? They were here. Oh my god, it's so close. Were they. I think they were here, right? Yeah, they're. Yeah, they were there. How much movement is that? Oh, you lucky bastard. <laughs> it can't reach you. <laughs> wow. Well, you are face to face with this now. Alright. And, cool. um. Well, it can't reach you, so it's just gonna stay there and a little bit. Honestly, but I'm kind dang. of excited for that. I'm kind of excited for that now. I'm now awake. I was falling asleep for a <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> okay, hold on. Mm, fuck. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'll do. Wait, is everyone in 30 feet from yeah, me? Hold on. Uh, what do I do? Is the uh, what? Is everyone 30 feet from me? All three of them. Yeah. Okay, I'll cast yeah. aid on each of them, so you'll have Ooh. five hit points each. Extra temp. It's extra and max, right? Yeah. Wait, uh, aid. Each target. I believe it does. Target hit points maximum, crit hit points increased by yeah, for the duration. So yeah, your max and your current. Both good add. Mm. So how much uh, Layla gets healed for five? Yeah. 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 That's so high. Okay, that's an action. What can I say? Do. Everyone gets. How much is your guys's HP now? 44 I'm for me. still full. Oh, plus 5. No, no, your, max, Add... your max HP gets plus 5. Yeah, because yeah. of 8. Because of 8. What's a little bit of HP now? No, no, I'll only only 3. So, oh, only uh, okay. Shadow, Layla, and Feed. What's, what's Shadow's HP with a plus 5? Uh, hold yeah, on. Your max. Let me grab the fucking. Where'd it go? Uh, you have 34 are. HP, so plus 5 would be... B... 39? Okay, so 39. Nice. Awesome. Uh, max and current, right? Yeah, max and current. And for bonus. Oh no. Well, every each of my spells is an action. Oh no! <laughs> oh, pain. Each spell pain. is an action. You have bardic. 
Oh yeah. Oh, that's true. Uh, yeah. You know what? Sure. Incident in the end. Who should I give Bardic to? Uh, let's see. Hmm, a Shadow might need it. Yeah, I'll give Bar uh, Sh uh, Bardic to Shadow. Hmm. Hey, Sh <laughs> Shadow, you get Bardic. A bit. I got what? Uh, Maybe. moving anywhere or? Oh, moving. Oh, oh no, no, I'll, I'll let it there. there. Stay there. Yeah, as the bar there. Maybe it's just I, like encouraging. Yeah, I like, think I think I'll probably I think I'll probably stay there, but I think I could. I'm oh, thinking no, of, um, like trying to. It's, it's no wait. It's still my turn. Yeah. It's still a bit oh. turn. Oh. There's an initiative. That's why we have initiative, so we won't. Yeah. But, all right. Yeah, all right. I'll, I'll stay right there for now. Okay. I know you know. I'll back up next to Creed. Oh. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, like that. Okay. <sighs> and okay, Shadow, now it's your turn. Alright. You have awesome. an action, a bonus, and movement. I'll try to do action. Uh action would be since you're a rogue. Let me see your stuff. I have a, I have a rapier and a dagger. And also a short bow. So yeah. Wait, but Bardic does this, by the way. You have that. If, if, yeah, if, if you attack the rapier, you have to be 5 feet, so you have to move forward and be this close. Melee range. Melee range, yeah. May I have to be on melee range. Okay, um, that's cool. Um, hold on. I'll try attacking it with my rapier. Okay, no roll to hit. Go to Bardic if you want. Roll a what? How much does the bardic do again? It's like it gives you advantage. On that roll and plus oh wait. Uh, well, he can roll first before choosing the bardic. Yeah. yeah. What's the bardic again? I uh, roll the roll to hit first. Yeah. Okay. Hold on. One d eight plus five. Oh no! Wait, roll a one d twenty plus oh. your to hit. You need to hit first. Sorry. <laughs> Plus my two hits. Wait, huh? Yeah, your two hit. This says right. Like, it should be like your dex plus your proficiency. My dex plus proficiency. What? Your dex plus <laughs> proficiency. That's not... Uh, five, six, seven. It's a, it's a plus seven. Five <laughs> plus, no, that's plus the five. Throw. Save, plus five is the saving throw. Proficiency is two, so that's seven. But you're using your save? No, it's your plus three. That's your that's your yeah, mod modifier. So it'll be a plus five. It will be a plus five. Dexterity so roll... is plus five. That's a saving that's throw. Your, yeah. Oh. The saving throw Dexterity. is different for me. Dexterity is plus three, yeah. The plus yeah. three. Oh, roll plus, roll, roll that deep. Roll that deep. Alright. <laughs> oh, no. Yep, use that bardic. You can you use wanna... the bardic if you want, but what... uh, how, sure, much how much does bardic give? How much does bardic give? It's a. Uh... It's so long. Bardic can save. Oh, okay, bardic can save. I save one now. Damn. Yeah, that's a one. Like, that yeah, is a one. Here. I just realized that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. Oh god, oh. I'm fucked. Oh, okay. Let me read your features. My features. Has... Okay, hasn't taken a turn, so I wouldn't have applied here. Grappler. Okay, that's that's your action, so it misses. You have a bonus action. As a rogue, since you are a rogue, you can bonus action to disengage, hide, or dash. Disengage, disengage. means you can, yeah, you can run, run away. away without taking an attack. Yeah. Uh, uh, where, uh, where, where are you uh, running? Uh, back words, if that makes sense. Yeah. Oh, that. Yeah. How far? Um, how <laughs> can I go? 
You can go 30... Was it 30 feet? How much does Tabaxi get? Uh... Let's see. Oh, it's just 30, yeah. You can go 30 feet. I'll try uh, 20. Speed, I'll try 20. Yeah, that's that's as far as a 20 can go. Alright. So, does your bonus, your action... Movement, I don't think you have anything left. I guess so, I don't... Okay. Creed, it's your turn. Nice. Whew. All right. Creed's gonna... Uh, okay. uh -oh. <laughs> I'm gonna... He's gonna reach down and he's gonna place his hand on Lilibet's head. Well, this thing's great. Here you go. Uh, that's what Sanctuary does. So that's one spell slot, and I think that's my action. That was a bonus action. That was a, a bonus, bonus action. The bonus Tasty. action. And that's just there for one minute. Yeah. Pretty much, if anything tries to attack, they have to roll a wisdom save. They fail. They need to attack a different creature or just waste their attack action on her. I see. Uh, and with that, I'm gonna. You see, I'm gonna see how I flavor that though. Okay. Right. Like, the. He, like, places his hand on her head and just kind of ruffles her hair a bit. And, like, as he does, there's, like, this. This small, like, field of energy just kind of appears around her, just kind of swirling a little bit. Then he bangs his gauntlets together, and I'm gonna go and punch the manacle. <laughs> do do, 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 do. <laughs> yeah. So she, if she does anything, it ends. <laughs> Dude, that's actually all oh, my spells. The fuck, bro. <laughs> yeah, but like, if anything comes to try to fuck you up, you're fine. Okay, as long as it isn't an enemy. Okay, I can do shit. I can still yeah. yeah. do yeah. shit. <laughs> I can do stuff. Yeah, it's like you can healing word and bardic, but you can't use like cantrips on bad guy. Uh, yeah, like cold person or shatter or thunder. Yeah, wave. yeah exactly. She uh, casts okay. thunder wave again in any closed. <laughs> <laughs> no, I learned my sense, and I won't do it's that. Two fucking furries, they deserve it. No. Okay. Anyways. Uh, roll to hit. Yeah, my luck's gone. <laughs> that that uh, misses. Yeah, sit in the corner. <laughs> uh, that uh, misses. Yeah. Try to punch. Right, how try much... to punch the magic car, but it dodges. How much out of movement the way. was that? A little bit. That was fifteen. Okay, can I get to the other side of the mana core? Uh, which side? Um, the top. Top. So like, cool. uh, uh, like that. Yeah, there. Okay, thirty feet. Oh wait, actually, hold on. That, that, and that. Okay, yeah, I have thirty. That's a good spot. I like that spot. I will be there. That's it for Is me. That Okay. Well, uh, Cyborg's turn. It sees you getting close. It sees you getting closer. <laughs> goes here. Looks at you straight in the eye. And from his chest... <coughs> from his chest, you can see something bluish... Oh, uh, no. Not bluish. Purple-ish light up within him. And it goes from his throat and then to his mouth. Opens his oh, mouth no. and then you can see electricity forming in front of his his throat and well it will shoot lightning out of its mouth towards you nice we love to see it war uh Man. robot versus a robot you love to see it oh my love goodness it. oh my god see? is that hit that that hits yes okay surprisingly creed doesn't have shield <laughs> <laughs> it it <Yeah>. <laughs> 
its entire body just surging with electricity and shoots it from straight to free. A little bit, you can see really. And you take that damage. Oh, God. Seven damage. Okay. <laughs> that was a uh, okay ish roll, but okay. <laughs> yeah, I was I, I was debating whether I should absorb elements. We'll just take that. We won't absorb. It it does does absorb element absorb lightning damage? Yeah. Mm. Everything pretty much all elemental damage but poison. <laughs> oh okay. Yeah, that's yeah. I can absorb bit, sound. Oh. I can absorb oh. thunder damage with absorb elements. But I can't absorb poison. There. And that's its turn. Leila, you're up. Ooh. Learning from my past yeah. mistakes. <laughs> Hunter's Mark and the Manticore? Yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. There's so much stats. There you go. <laughs> Hunter's Mark damage, right? If... Yeah. A D4 of extra damage, yeah. Yeah. I remember it from Amber. Yeah, I used that yeah, a lot as Amber. Whenever you hit it with a weapon attack, you have advantage. Oh, yeah. So it's an extra 1d6. Yeah, d6. The d4 was the, the other one. It was favored enemy, I believe. That's what... Mm. Yeah. Uh, did she roll to hit? Or not yet? I'll move bottom right diagonally. There. I like that. Is the Manticore considered a bee? I... nope. It's not. <laughs> it's a monstrosity. Yeah, that makes sense. Manticore are like fusions of like multiple creatures, so it wouldn't be a, yeah. it wouldn't be a beast. Yeah. 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 Bottom right in front of the tube. So here. Yeah. Okay. What do you do, Ranger? Seventeen. That hits. I shoot. Why? Why is that to roll? Wait. Did you have a range? Let, let me look. Uh. Okay. If you're using the Gloomstalker thing, it only goes for that first turn, I believe. Oh, wait, no. At the start of your first turn of each combat. Okay, first turn. I think she did add archery. Did you? No. Okay, it'd be a plus seven. Which would... Turn that 14 and that would turn the 12 into a 14 and the 17 into a 19. If the 12 turns into a 14, then both. Our tree is good. good. So, yeah, get you uh. hit two times. I think at the start of your first turn of each combat. Read yeah, is that last? Uh, is that the entire combat, or is it only on the first turn? My brain's fucking with me. Of each combat, so yeah, at of the start of combat. your first turn. First turn. This isn't. Her f I don't know how that works. So would she have the second attack? First no. turn of each okay. combat. Okay. So you wouldn't have the second attack. So it's technically just one. That one this hit. Six. Six. Cause it, yeah, it says each combat, not each. Yeah, 
That would be kind of broken. Aw, oh, dang. <laughs> so, just 14 damage, I assume? 14 damage is still good. Yeah. Yeah. Still damage. Yeah. And that's my turn. Okay, Manticore's turns. It can do something with you right next to it. It will attack you two times. Oh. Why? I, mean, I didn't. I didn't stab you. The bitch over there tried to fuck. <laughs> You're right you. next Come to me. them. I know, but like she, she. I mean, I'm the tank here. Why not hit me? <laughs> <laughs> Why not hit me? <laughs> Sixteen right, and twenty-three. One of those. One of those, one hit, of those hit. Okay. Yeah. 1d6 plus 3. And I'm trying to check something real quick. That boom, that's a 1. Uh. And whoop! It has claws, a mouth, and a tail. So it has one more attack. Who would it be? The bitch has three? <laughs> yeah, Manticore has three. <laughs> Fucking hell! Okay! Okay, one, two, three. Cool. If it hit. Oh no! <laughs> it has. It has to roll a wisdom save then. It has to roll a wisdom save, okay. Okay. Yeah. Little bit you can just see this tail aiming to with what's the Manticore's wisdom? It's a plus one. Eight. Well, that fails. <laughs> <laughs> it has to okay. attack someone else. So one shadow, two Layla. It's Lay <laughs> Layla. <laughs> I give no. it the tail. It it, it's, it 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 goes to you with the tail again. <laughs> That's another. I'm sorry. Creed doesn't give a fuck about you two, but he only cares about Lilibet. So. Take seven damage. <laughs> okay, and that's it's. It's gonna. Oh, down one more. It's gonna stay there. Lilibet, it's your turn. Okay, I'm gonna cast Bane on the Manticore. Bane would get rid of it Sanctuary, hit you. but it did his job once. It hit, uh, the Manticore hit you with oh, it. Oh, wait. No. Wait, 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 no. It's up to you <laughs> whether you want to keep the Sanctuary or not. If you want to do something else, do it. Because Bane would actually be useful. All of my things affect the enemies or someone else, dude. They can't do anything else. But, but I'm gonna cast Bane. It it's saved you from spell. damage once. That's enough for you far enough away to leave the two cat people within range. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna cast Bane on it. Okay. Bane? Let me see. Yep. Okay, I believe Sanctuary yeah. ends. Yeah. I'm gonna play I'm gonna play for this, why not? Yeah. A little bit just cast slings over. Yeah, if the warder creature over. makes an attack roll, cast a spell that affects an enemy, yes, so it ends. So, which one are you casting Bane to? The uh, Libet guy has like, slings their guitar over and just some, uh, strums their strings very loudly, and as that happens, her guitar kind of glows a bit. You see this magic work that. <laughs> Your mic's kind of uh, muffled. Oh Johnny's god. mic is dying. Oh my god, is it good now? Yeah, okay, it's yeah. Now. Oh my god, it just fell. Okay. Yeah, did I cut off everything? <laughs> did not hear anything. I kind heard you strum <laughs> strings really loud. That's what I heard. Yeah, loudly. Okay, yeah, then, yeah, as he does that, her guitar glows, and as you see this, the Manticore kind of like winces and winces in pain as it passes Bane on it. So, the D4 penalty. So, I think. Oh, three creatures of your choice. You can cast Bane on both of them and me if you want. No. And him. No, 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 no. <laughs> oh, I got so, yeah, the, sure. cast Bane on these two. Two of them. Two of them, yeah. Can I just be two, yeah, or do I just need to have what saving three? throw? Charisma. What saving throw was it? Charisma. Charisma. These guys can't be charismatic. They <laughs> can't be charismatic. Come on. Let's start with the manticore. 
Manticore. Yeah, oh makes sense. God, he was a zero. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, uh, that's Bane. <laughs> Bane, bitch. He got Bane. And this one. Bane. Come on, you can't Actually, do that. Actually, just Someone's has a fat zero. Wait, wait. Is oh my Sanctuary touch? Oh my it's not god. Not it again. <sighs> Sanctuary is oh with god. range of 30 feet. Me no. struggling to stay awake. <laughs> my rolls today. Oh, I rolled so one. Oh my god. Bro. Oh, the Sanctuary go away? Yeah, the Sanctuary is gone. The yeah, Sanctuary dropped because she cast a spell that affects- I can cast it again. My luck. I thought it was touch range, but it's not. It has a range of 30 feet. Then, as bonus, I'll give another Bardic to leave this time. Uh, can you give Bardic to- Okay. <laughs> but can uh, I? Or you <laughs> give- Oh, nice. uh, Bardic. Bardic inspiration. Hey, escort NPC, don't die. Okay. <laughs> so, so yeah, you have uh, Bardic Your creed is to don't touch the tiny halfling spell. If you do, I break your kneecaps. That's, that's what it is for creed. Yeah, and I'll, you know what? Yeah, I'll move backwards. Like, the yeah, I about. <laughs> How much? Uh, maybe fifteen. Diagonal. So fifteen, like that? Yeah, there. Uh, uh, okay. A square okay. up. A square up. A square yeah, up. There. Yeah, yeah that's it. Is that's that your turn? Okay. Shadow, it's your turn. Kaito? Ah, oh, hi. Sorry. It's okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, right, um... Okay, my turn, right? Mm-hmm. Nope. Uh, um, I will say you're a rogue, right? Yeah, Yeah. Rogue. you get sneak attack. You, you get sneak attack on the Manticore. If you shoot right. that guy. Yeah, you know what? Yeah, let's try that. Yeah. You have Control to, uh, yeah, run oh. an attack roll. You can choose to be ranged, you have a short bow, you can choose to use, use. I, yeah, sure, I could use that. So, uh, roll to hit first, and... Hold on, um, I can look for it. Uh, why, where the fuck it go? Up, oh, there you are. If uh, I'm... roll Let's... for attack, right, right? Yeah. So that's a nah. d20 plus 5, so... Okay. Mm -hmm. Oof. That's 11. Mm -hmm. Oof, 11. that miss. You have, you have Bardic, if you want to use it. Yeah. Uh, that yeah, I think safe. I can use Bardic this time. Yeah. Safe one? Yeah. Bardic dice or d6. So just roll a roll roll a d6. Rolling a d6. Jesus. So you use your bardic. If I fail on this one. Six. Okay. Now that hits. Now that hits. So level four. Let's see. It will be. You're using a short bow. Short. Yeah. Short bow would be one d6 plus five, and then. Plus attack. whatever rogue. Level four. Wait, Johnny, you know rogues. Yeah, it's a one d six. Or level four. Do I roll another d six? Yeah, that's your. Sneak yeah, roll two d six actually. Hey, you can just okay. do two d six as well. Yeah, uh, it, no, five. it would be one d six for the short bow plus six, and then plus two d six. Wait, is it still 1d6 because it's level 4? Nope. It gets up to... It's a 2d6 Hold on. Hold on. I need to gather... I need to gather my thoughts on what you said again from my tired ass mind. Uh, roll a 1d6 and then what? Plus 5 and 1d6. Rogues are one hit wonders. Thank you, Violet. 
Yep, yeah, bro. That. Mm. 1d6 plus 5 plus 2d6. Okay. Oh, awesome. oh, wow. That was a loop for damage. Rogues are indeed one hit one. So that's 19 Rogues damage. Are one hit one. But what 19 damage. That's a lot of damage. <laughs> that's a lot of damage. That was uh, a bonus oh, action. Do you have anything for a bonus action other than your cutting action? Uh, what uh, can I do? Like, disengage, hide, or dash. Yeah, and you could throw a dagger at it if you want. What, yeah. it, what do I do if I dash? Oh, no, no. You dash can just like, do move. extra move. Yeah, yeah. Okay, double. dash. I can do a dash. Where? I mean, dash, uh, you can, your base movement is 30 feet. If you dash, you can get sick. So, I think if I if I, I think if I dash, then um, uh, dash towards the enemy. I think you could reach <laughs> him normally, one? actually. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, you can just, uh, the you can just reach man, normally. Manticore, her, I think. Yeah. So Wait, just what? sorry. Yeah. Well, to the manticore, you can just use your normal. Yeah, you can use your I can just use my normal what? You kind movement. of movement. Movement. Oh, I mean, I you said I could like do for like an extra attack. No, extra no. movement. Not extra attack. movement. Sorry. Okay. okay, never mind. Uh, I guess I don't okay. have to do a bonus then. I, I okay, so that's, that's your turn. <laughs> Would that be your turn? Uh, it's three. <laughs> turn yeah okay creed you are in close in proximity to spot. these two i like this spot this is a nice spot oh. i am going to i never used this before so i'm gonna do it on my bonus action creed oh. you see his eyes glow as you can see like this control purple like static just kind of start Coding him. I'm gonna use defensive field. They'll give me four temporary hit points. Ooh. So get healed. You get plus four. Yeah. Four it's temp a, HP. A, a, yeah, it's four temp HP. And I'm going to fuck this Manticore. I don't give a fuck about you, bitch. I'm gonna go forward. <laughs> <laughs> you you want to take an attack of ability? Fuck yeah. Why not? <laughs> okay. Um, it will just this? try and fight you. Has Bane. Oh my it god! Bane. Oh, it doesn't Bane. matter! <laughs> it doesn't <laughs> matter! <laughs> wow, my rolls today are bad. Anyways. <laughs> and I am going to... Look, man! I'm gonna punch the duder. I do have okay. I do have Bardic, but I don't want to use it yet. So... Oh, well, no, you don't need it, it anyways. Okay. Hey. Yeah, that fits. Now we get this. Thunder it's damage thunder. and 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 funny mm -hmm. thing about the thunder gauntlet that I never fucking used last time. A creature hit by the gauntlet has disadvantage on attack rolls against targets other than you until the start of your next turn. So if he tries to hit anyone else, he has disadvantage. Oh. I could I should have I should have used that on the mana core. <laughs> <laughs> Too late now. On the Manticore? Okay, give no, me a I moment. Said I, 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 messed, it, I messed up. Well. I messed up on the yeah. math. Okay. Ten damage was it? And what does it do? Yeah. It does this. I'll just copy paste it. I look away and uh, what happened to Creed's HP? Oh, huh? here we go. Wait, what happened? I don't think nothing's happened to my HP. Oh no, it's because he's bigger, so like, he gets overlapped by this one. That's what I- that's oh. what I can do. Against- eh, disadvantage against other than you. Yeah, so it's disadvantage on anyone but me. So if he tries to hit oh, someone okay. else, he has disadvantage. Okay, well, well, 
only target there. I don't think he will. He seems to be very focused on me. <laughs> he is. But... You can see that. Yeah. But, well, that's just something the gauntlets do anyway. That's just a passive thing. But, yeah, that... Oh, okay. Uh, my bonus action and action. That's it for me. Okay, well, um, face to face with this guy again, he will... He, he like, he shakes his arms a bit and you can see three metal... Bl as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. Uh, Bane. He has Bane. Bane. Yeah. Oh, he also has Bane. <laughs> Uh, so what does uh, roll for Bane? Minus yeah, like a D4. A yeah. D4. Oh, a D4. Four. Four. Uh, Johnny rolled the, the the Bane for you. Alright. Ah, microphone. Oh, oh my god. F. I mean, you don't know. F. It could make a difference. Who knows? You don't know. Yeah. That's an 18. <laughs> That's exactly another nice. one. Minus minus uh, one. Minus one. Minus 17, one. 17 is my DC. My AC. Oh, okay. So it still does damage. That's another one for me. What the hell is wrong with my? Bad. That's just one D3. Okay. Six, six. damage. Get to my temp. And deals two. Oops, wrong one. Six damage. It will stay there. Its target is you. No, stay here, bitch. Okay. Hey, lights, your turn again. They'll kill this mana core. That's why I don't, don't care about it. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Shooting time. Go, Gloomstalker, go! Oh my! Never mind, oh you're my God. bad at this! <laughs> 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 Poor Ozzy, I feel so Never bad! Mind. Never mind. Bonus action! Can, what, can, what can you guys do as bonus action? Uh, healing I only have one bonus action. Is it Hunter's Mark? <laughs> No. What's the spell? Yes. Yeah, so. <laughs> <laughs> so I guess no. You're not moving or no? Uh. <laughs> I'll stay. Okay, so Manticore. Okay, so I read the multi attack wrong, but it still kind of works. Okay. It can make three attacks as well with only its tail spot. So it will shoot all three of you. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> no! Not the little one! No! Bane. You Bane. can see from the edges of its tail, its scorpion like tail, three spikes emerge and it moves its tail in whip like motion, launching these spikes towards your three companions. Okay. Well, okay. First of all, dice gods. Is my Please. luck bad just for. Three nat ones. That's still really bad. Oh, that 19. Baby. Okay, but first, let's see what I forgot. Who the third one? 1d3. <laughs> Actually, no, that one. No, <laughs> that would still. That would. If going with the same order, that would still be Layla. Oh, no. It really Layla. doesn't like her. <laughs> I mean, first, oh, it, 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 it's the first. She's the one who hit him first, so. get hit by the tail every time. Another okay. one? Oh what the god. hell did we be with ones? No, oh my god. Layla take more damage. And it will go here. Uh oh. And that's its turn. A little bit. Okay. Let me see something. I have so many ones. I am... oh, They're getting close and personal. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh. <gasps> DM lock. <laughs> My DM lock is reverse. Okay, what does a 10 foot radius look like again? 10 foot radius sphere. <laughs> oh, it's DM not a sphere. <laughs> I was hoping you would thunder wave. 
<laughs> and kill everyone. Are you casting? <laughs> what are you casting? I'm trying to see if I can cast Stator on that Manticore. What's the sense uh, what? spirit look like? You cast which one? Shatter? Yup. 10 foot radius spear centered on a point. On that point. Yeah. Oh, okay. So, spear. Right. Yeah. I'm just seeing, I'm just seeing. Okay. Rad it's a radius, right? So, yep. that. Oh. For, mm, for this move time, it. I will roll my action dice. <laughs> move it a bit to the right, maybe. So it doesn't hit the shadow. Wait, hold on. Oh god. Ten feet radius. How do I cancel this again in map 2? Wait. I think if you press escape, that usually works for me. Oh, okay. Where do you move it? Maybe a bit to the right. Yeah, it works. <laughs> yeah, it works. That works. Uh, it's a close call, but yeah, it works. Wait, a close call? What does Shatter do? Let's see. It... Uh, let me... Let me... Let me do... Each creature must make a con... Yeah. Let's see. What's the Manticore's con... Oh, that's a pretty good con... Oh my god. Makes sense. Are you no. kidding me? Does it... Does it matter? So what? Whatever nope. these creatures have that is good, you can just just not think they're good because you're gonna. My roll that. is my. <laughs> Let's just be real. My my bad rolls are the reason that you guys are winning. <laughs> yeah, I think we would be dead otherwise. This is a sign oh, to use yeah. IRL dice. I would l I would love to use IRL dice for my games, but oh, I have I, have, I don't have access. I have well, I have IRL dice. Give them okay, to me. Oh. Fucking hell! God oh, damn! God. <laughs> I'm sorry, but the way you delivered that started reminding me of Gilbert Gottfried. Holy, holy hell! But holy hell is it erotic! So, 21 oh, damage. Five. Let me actually see. God. Do I kill it this survives thing? on 3 HP. <laughs> this bitch. Oh boy. I'm going yeah. to. Uh, whose turn is it going to be next? Uh, is that your turn, Nayla? Someone punch it. <laughs> I yeah. <laughs> I wish I could do the honors. Yeah, yeah. Well, a little bit? That was a little yeah. bit's turn. Yeah, yeah so... a little bit just like does this high yeah. pitch note. Yeah. <laughs> and the manticore is just like bleeding from its eyes and ears. That's what happened. You can just see its ears actually bleeding now, and it's sh shrinking in pain. Nice. Poor manticore. Poor SMH, manticore. little bit murder hobo confirmed. <laughs> and <laughs> I'll move like 10 feet to the right. Just straight. Yeah, straight line, 10 feet to the right. Ten feet away to from the right. that right. Okay. Away from that radius, just in case. Okay. Is that your and turn? That... And... Yep. Yeah. Okay. Well, Shadow, you know what to do. Alrighty, go. Let's do this. Uh, you got how about I use here. my dagger? Let me use my dagger. A dagger. <laughs> dagger. I feel like this. I feel like it's enough. How many HP is it again? Three. Three. And Unless you roll much? a one. <laughs> oh god. A dagger is a one d four plus. Next. You know yeah, what? Let's not make this too. Three. Let's not make this too so... easy. I think I'm gonna grab a rapier this time again. Oh. <laughs> or ah, fuck it, dagger. Whatever. I mean, that's... sorry. Uh, I feel like the rapier would give you a better chance. Okay, yeah. Okay, rapier. She's <laughs> roll so one. Of... Okay. Of... He I am so afraid of rolling a one. Rolls. So if he rolls a one, it'll be four damage, which would be enough to kill it. All right, uh, our uh, 1d20 plus uh, five, right? Plus five. Okay, mm. that's it. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, yeah. Okay, yep, that hits. Come on. Yep, that hits and much more. Yeah, you can you you can probably end it really. Just I don't think there's a way you can not 
It would be low 3 HP. Do you, but let's just do see. You, do you non lethal the manicor? Do you non lethal the manicor? How but do is you that wanna supposed do to mean you? non lethal? Do you, do you not kill it? Yeah, it's not uh, just knock it out, but not kill it. <laughs> Pokemon, not knock it out. Um, actually, wait. Um, maybe. Um, I'll try uh, killing it. What? That's uh, I. Yeah, you can you kill it either way. So if you wanna explain how you kill the man, yeah, how do you flavor flavor your kill? How do you do this? Flavor your kill. Yeah. Uh... With the way with the way I'm thinking of rapier, I was just kind of thinking of the sword like slicing, I guess. Slice up just once and then it's yeah. So you slit its throat and then blood just gushes right out and into your face as well. It ring Yummy. it it rivel it it rivels in pain until Yummy. with with the pain with the painful sensation on its ears, bleeding out. It loses too much blood and it eventually just psh, dies. I should say my my bad luck is the reason this one's dead. <laughs> yeah, you, yeah. That's, you my, I have so luck, but yeah. You and your shitty ass that one. <laughs> yeah, I have so many ones. Anyway, Creed is your. Now time for that. I love. I, what is uh, that electric guitar? I just should I just. Should I just punch a bitch? I can punch it and then bonus action dagger if I wanted to. Where did my Ooh. fucking phone go? I need you to roll, bitch! Get back here! <laughs> yeah, we'll try to we'll try to punch it. Oh. Uh Nice. Okay, how much was your bardic? D6. <laughs> a D6, okay. I was saving it for what I missed as attack. Alright, yeah, did I remove? Oh my god. I doubt an 11 hits. Nope, that doesn't hit. Okay. I'll, I guess I can. I'll kind of bonus action dagger it then. If you allow me. Uh, I mean, you punched. Use your. Did you just use your gauntlets or something? Yeah, my gauntlets. I. I mean, it made. It'll make sense. I'd say I'll allow it. Alright, nice. Because you. So you can just grab your dagger mid punch. Okay. Here we go. I don't have. If I hit. I hit. Of course, I hit with a dagger. It's just a flat d4 because <laughs> I don't know. It's annoying, but still. I mean, damage is damage. Two damage. Two piercing damage. <laughs> You're not the only one who gets two attacks, bitch. Wahaha! <laughs> and I'll bonus action defensive field again. Okay. Let's give myself four attempt. Or four more attempt. And okay. that's my turn. Let me let me put you up front so I can see your. <laughs> There Everyone. we go, now I can see your HP. Everyone, what do you think? Should we, uh, uh, should we gangbang the guy? Oh my <laughs> god. Basically, the plan right? Should I- the, the side Should I try my IRL dice with this? Do it, right, yes. Try. Do because it. my do luck. It. Yes. Oh, it, it will- it will multi attack you with its arm blade again. Okay. Well, uh, first time rolling IRL dice, it's- all right, let's see, let's see what. Uh, happens. first one misses, of course. <laughs> second one, oh, wait, it. Second one. Nope, it still misses. <laughs> oh my god! So My luck is bad, real even life. in real life. <laughs> I could probably even one v one this I, dude. I, I you shit, know what's no? I shit, I shit you not. I rolled I a four why. and a three. I I know why this is happening. It's Friday the thirteenth. Oh. <laughs> yeah. It's Friday the just third. gonna like these attacks just come and scrape his exterior. 
not even like making enough of a dent to do anything, and he's just like, I... "So you're she's been working on, huh? You're a uh, fucking yeah. disappointment." And that's uh... my turn. Well, that's I that should, you know, my turn. I rolled a three turn. and a four. Projection, but Project. anyways, <laughs> Layla. <laughs> Layla, it's actually, let's let's go here, like, yeah. and then it's your turn, Layla. Wants to. I mean, it sees it. It sees that the manticore is down. It wants to try and get as much. Shoot in time. That hits. Ugh. My. I'm. Wow, my luck is bad even IRL. <laughs> <Damn>. <laughs> That's. Third. That just. That's What's the extra one these two for? That is Hunter's Mark. Hunter's Mark, yeah. Which honestly, you, have, you haven't rolled you have to roll concentration for that, actually, because you got hit like twice. Oh, oh yeah. Roll two times for con. You also, the, the Hunter's Mark is also in the Mantic, not in this guy. Yeah, it's on the Mantic oh, yeah. as well. You can just. You can three. bonus action move it if it, if then it stays. Shoot. Yeah, then yeah. shoot. Yeah, roll the concentration yeah. first. Yeah, roll the cotton staves. Let me remove Hunter's Mark here. Wait, if... Wait. If you got hit by the Manticore and the, ma and the ma Hunter's Mark was on the Manticore, wouldn't we just alright and you just switch? Okay, oh. it stays! Okay, so you move it to this guy. As a bonus action. Sorry, yeah. I'm such a fucking... Slayer. <laughs> no, it's, it's fine. It's alright. So, uh, using the same that roll? was how much damage? Thirteen. Using... I mean, we can use the same roll, yeah. Thirteen damage. Oops. Oh. There you go. I'll move back ten feet. Next to a little bit. Just oh. down. How far is the cyborg from me? Uh, it's your turn. How far? Yeah. It's 35 feet. Oh, okay, I'll... yeah. I'll get rid of the shatter on that area and move it towards this guy. No, hit me! No, I'm not gonna hit you. I'm gonna make sure it doesn't hit. So it's like... <laughs> Wait, uh, what? Um, I'm gonna cast shatter on the cyborg one, yeah. I'm a position hit where I I won't hit Creed. Yeah, like like just there. Yep. So another. Or wait, what is that again? It's a crit constitution. Yeah. Oh, yeah, con save. They have the same con actually. I'm not gonna trust my IRL dice, so I'll just go with. <laughs> you trust every my... more, bro. I don't know, man. I don't trust any of my dice. <laughs> we know my relationship with dice. And it's bad. Oh okay. my god. Okay, it, 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 yeah, it, it succeeds. So it still took half, half It's damage. just half damage, right? Yeah. Sixteen, so... so like eight. Eight. Eight damage. Yeah. Ching. Eight. Eight. Okay, and Under. I'll move 15 feet up closer. Yeah. 15, okay. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, and I'll go. Uh, no, I'll save uh, that one. So that's good. Uh, I'll end my turn there. Okay, Shadow, it's your turn. I told. Ah, right. Okay. Um. Be right okay. for skin. Wait. Oh. Can I can I make a movement and then shoot the guy? Yeah, you can. Okay. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Uh, I can. You okay. Then I'll do that. Probably him if you wanted to. Um. Uh, 
three grids right, three grids uh, up. How much is that? Okay. Uh. Um... All right. Yeah. And then I want to do uh, shoot the cyborg with the yep. uh, bow. With the bow. Roll to hit. Yep. Uh, how much again? Yeah, plus five still. The D twenty plus five. Yeah. All right. Oh, that that doesn't hit. Ah. Oh. Uh, okay, doesn't hit. Uh, next, someone is is that is that the turnover then? I think so. Okay, okay. Creed. You definitely can see that. Well, the inventor has lost her charm a bit. Mm hmm. Apparently, because uh. my luck is so bad. <laughs> Okay. I don't want to risk missing again. Magic missile. Ooh, okay. So we just roll a. Uh, roll 3d4? Uh, uh, not the most damage, but. That's 10. 10, ten force damage. That's still enough, bad. Ah, here we go. Creed. You see Creed's eyes glow as these like three beams just kind of it hits the fucking cyborg. Fucking useless. Damn. And, Damn. Uh, that's it for me. <laughs> okay. Really? Out okay, here. let me. This is like <laughs> this is therapy. Like therapy. Therapy. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'll roll once only and see if Avery has changed their mind on my luck first. It's the, f it's the first attack, so let's see. Oh, oh finally! Nice! Only by two, finally, but still. It okay, there's a first damage, so let's do the damage. Nope, that's I still a one. <laughs> they didn't even do nothing to me. That was yeah. my 10th HP. The I second that one <laughs> missing. Yep. That's your temp HP gone. Yep. Did full hmm. Damage. You know what? Let's see. Its situation is very, very oh, dire. Oh no. So let me read the notes I have. Actually, he's gonna murder us. Uh oh, what's he gonna do? I could, oh, with how I would be with how bad snow is rolling, I could legitimately <laughs> solo this guy. <laughs> yeah, I could actually one v one him. It's my <laughs> my rolls are the reason. Be lucky. Yeah, the reasons we're still alive. Yep. Yeah. God, I love God. Uh, thank I I'm glad that we had scheduled it at this perfect. time. <laughs> Friday the 13th. You, you know what? It will just run the fuck away. No, <laughs> hold, hold person. You can take an attack of opportunity. Can I do hold do person? No, oh, it's not your uh, turn. Is that a, oh. is that, that's an action. And yeah, I get the feeling that's not a humanoid. So it's called home person for a reason. Oh. Yeah. Is it humanoid? No. <laughs> okay. Oh. It, you can just see it retreating. So, Layla, it's your turn. My, insult, my insults are getting to it. Bitch, <laughs> <laughs> baby. Shoot it. Shoot it. Finish it off. <laughs> I'm sick, and I'm still beating your ass. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay Layla, right, what do you do? As you... Can you even reach with the both? Yeah, it's a long bow. The bow has a if very it's a, it's long range. Bow, so. If it's a long bow, then fuck yes, she can, she can hit yeah. it. Yeah. Azzy, are you still there? I just yeah. noticed that's the, I just noticed that this map does have blueprints of things here. 
Nice. Well, I didn't see that before. So, Azzy? Azzy? Did you fall asleep, Azzy? Azzy! Is that... <laughs> oh Sorry. no. King Azzy? Azzy? Azzy. Oh dear. Wake the fuck up, Samurai. Is Azzy awake or...? Oh, and she fell asleep? I mean, did you, she did say that she was slowly drifting to sleep. Yeah, oh no, I'm slowly yeah. drifting away to sleep. <laughs> I think Ozzy's dead. Uh-oh. Oh wait, no, Ozzy said BRB for skincare stuff. Alright! Oh! Yeah, this right here. It'll Wait. be quick. That was six minutes ago. <laughs> I didn't see that. <laughs> and Ozzy and Gen A. <laughs> Damn, I, I accidentally put Shatter in Gen 8, so... <laughs> okay, no so wonder what I now? didn't see my thing in the chat. Alright, so what now? <laughs> oh, wait. While we're waiting, let me test my luck with my IRL dice. So... <laughs> Do that. And then he, and seven. then Snow suddenly has really good luck until we. The moment the session ends. <laughs> oh god! Oh, that fell to the floor. Ooh. My parents, my 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 uh, mom, ain't like gonna like the fact that I'm out to this late. <laughs> Welcome to D&D, this is how long we usually play. <laughs> yep. Oh, she and he's is. back. How's your You're skin? Back. My yeah. skin is wonderful. Oh wait, you're talking to Ozzy. <laughs> <laughs> but still, my skin feels wonderful. Oh, that's nice. It's your turn, by the way. Oh. Yeah. Uh, wake the dog up, Samurai. <laughs> the skill food up, fresh and hydrated. Good. Nice. Very uh, good. 65. Oh, you can still reach him. Yeah, you can definitely reach yeah, him. Yeah, 65 feet. You can still reach him with the bow. Okay, shoot. Shoot! Go for it. I... At this okay. point, I'm just... At this point, it's kind of a sign that you guys are winning. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Kobe. Mark. I shall also shoot uh, uh, once it's my turn. That's a 12. Shooting is fun. <laughs> I wait. That's a plus 3. Yeah. So 10 damage. Oh. Bop. No, you have. Oh no, you don't. Wait, do you? Oh yeah, fucking Archer. Hey, Archer. So, so it would still be a plus five. So. Yeah. Ozzy. <laughs> Ozzy, keep forgetting. <laughs> oh. Oh, don't worry, Ozzy. I'm also oh. like very sleepy right now. I can't even do whole person. The second level spell, I don't have one. <laughs> oh, that's a damage. Oh, wait. It goes for both. It's like the version yeah. of dueling. Actually, oh, I, think still I think it only goes for damage. I think. Me, me and check. Le yeah. Me and Layla are just gonna keep shooting the cyborg until it dies. Yeah, I'm gonna keep. Beating the shit out of it. Our tree is only, only a hit. Oh, it is only the. Oh. <laughs> okay. I just love the fact that you were able to one v one it, and now it's like half, half close to dying. I'm sorry, it's like. Oh, I know. Oh, oh, op, and also the fact that. A, has a plus two luck. bonus to hit with all ranged weapons, yeah. 
Man, life really... Life really has something out for you. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh, is that done with your turn? Uh... Who's next? Okay. I think it's me, right? Yeah. It's you. It me. It you. <laughs> it you. Oh, we don't it want this. You. We don't want him getting away, right? I can't do old person no. either. It's a second devil spell, and I don't have any more second spells. Second devil spell slots. The chance that this is a person uh, is very low. Because hold person yeah. is only for humanoid creatures. Yeah, and I don't have any more second level spell slots either, so I can't even cast it. We don't want to get away, right? <laughs> no. My only thing that can might help is fucking wave. <laughs> because reach? my other spells, my other spells are bane, cure wounds, and healing word, and my ten trips are feed ward, message, and minor illusion. I can't do shit, bro. That's the only thing I can do. Wait, okay. what's my? Wait, 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 wait. I have twenty-five speed. I don't think. Oh no! Five, yeah, we can't eight, hear you, Snow. my size. Oh yeah, your small size. You look at Pony Fly. No, I can't reach it either. I think I don't think I can still reach it. Because if I use twenty-five, so that would be five. 10, 15, 20, 25. I'll be at next to Creed. And it's a 15 foot. Wait, no. Alright, it's a 15 mm. foot cube. Yeah. Originated from you. So it would be. It might hit. 5, 10. Block short. Mm. Yeah. As an action speed. We can end, we can probably After end the this. session once, yeah. He's dead. Up to snow. I can't believe he's doing shit. I'm using my other mic. I'm using my other mic. Oh, okay. There she is. Anyways, uh, what was Johnny trying to do? She doesn't know. <laughs> the, the, the thunder wave? <laughs> I don't know. I can't. Um, hmm. Do I have anything else oh. that... You're here. Uh, yeah, 25 you're like, feet. You're 55 feet away from it. So like 25 would get me to where Creed is. That would still be enough because it's a 15 foot cone. Right there, yeah. Yep, yeah, I still can't reach him. Could just so... chill by him. <laughs> That's probably uh... about it. Yeah, I'll just... I'll just stay there. I'm fine. I'll just chill there. I'm but fine, But Ozzy yeah. and Kaido seem to be suffering. Yeah. I'll just chill that. there. Uh, can I throw a dagger at him? No, he's a little rich. I, I guess? Sure. Yeah, let's try. Let's do it. Okay, let's try. Oh, that hits. Okay. Okay. Four. That's a five. Not bad. Okay. Nice. I guess that's it. Okay. That's uh, kind of alive. Y'all still good? Y'all, y'all, we I think they're yeah, dead. I think they're sleeping now. I'm back. Yeah, oh, I'm back. Yeah, I'm back. Yay. Uh, I, I was at my, I was at the comfort room trying to brush teeth. Um, okay, so it's my turn now, I suppose. Yep, okay, mm -hmm. yeah, I will, uh. Can I maybe go close? Uh, how? Uh, can I shoot them from this far? Yeah, you can. Uh, yeah. Sure. All right, shooting. I'm shooting. 
Uh, I I'll keep shooting. One d twenty, and then plus five. Hope to God it hits. As oh, no. he died. As he died. Oh Fuck no! Me. All right. As a fourteen hit, I don't think. No, it doesn't hit. Damn. Yeah. Then... This is gonna take a, a while. You could bonus action dash, you might reach him. That's... What? Dash? Yeah. You, yeah. Him. you can get close to it. Alright, I'll dash. Want. If you want, if you I'll want. Dash. Just, just you, can, you can go can like... Too. Yeah, that's... Yeah, that, 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 that actually... Yeah. That near, that near. To 40. Yeah, to this 40. Yeah. 40 or 45? Not, not 40, 40. Okay. Go there. Is that your right, turn? I'm or? Uh, I'm good, so I supposedly. Oh, uh, Creed you can probably one shot this now. Do it, come on, please. Please, dude. Oh, one shot. Uh, I'll go up to the bitch. Go. Do okay. it, do it. Come on. You're wondering what I have. Smash, smash, <laughs> smash. A big boy. I could. I could Not the big it. boys. <gasps> Thunder Raven hit Chen. Hey. Oh, yeah, it's all for getting close. <laughs> yeah, it's a 15 foot cone. Yeah, originated from you. Then I could punch it. As well, but mm. I might miss. I could magic missile it again. You could. You might roll big. No. Hmm. It doesn't seem that much. Yeah. And well, oh, yeah. it's just flat damage. There's no chance of like negating it unless you have resistance. So, oh, what are you trying to do? Oh, magic missile? Yeah, oh, magic missile again. Eye lasers. Let's go, eye lasers. Yeah. Uh, Come on. Roll good. You've been rolling really good. Nine. Mm -hmm. That's a thing. That was okay. meh roll, but uh, it's still damage. Yeah. He's close, he's close to going down. We just need one more hit, probably. Is that it, or...? I'm gonna get... a uh, ...square. Is the square on top of it? This one? Yeah. Okay. You know... I've never fucking ran from a fight in my life. She really did get bad for what she does. And that's my mm -hmm. turn. Uh, Dragon. <laughs> I'm just degrading this poor yard. fucking thing. Yeah. I mean, you are kind of your first successful girl, so it makes sense. Yeah. Well, the um, thing is, she should have from from me. She should have gotten better. She's only seemingly gotten so worse. <laughs> what would this one do? Uh, yeah, we'll just keep running. Doesn't care, bro. Right, I'm gonna try to smack me. Bitch. Me playing Howard. chess. Honestly, that's how I play chess back then. <laughs> Run away. Back to where you first saw him. That's <laughs> it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, hit. Come on. One shot. One shot uh, it. Ooh, that's ooh. Cool. <laughs> Is that enough? Nope. Oh. Fuck. So close. Well, so close. Well, uh, you see him? See him stand here where you first saw him, and well, he did what he was gonna do. He was gonna eat fuck away, and 
Under the th you see this balloon here standing on green. Okay, this this uh carving on the floor right here. You start to see it glow. And just as it glows everything starts to shake and these these windows black mist starts to emerge. What? Yep. And before you know it, this guy has dissipated somewhere. He has, he has, he has form, see his form start to shift, then from behind you, metal bars block the door. Oh no. Uh oh. And then the mist starts to circle around you guys, like this whole area here. And then everything, everything, everything turns dark to you guys. Ooh, it, it, it becomes dark. You can't see anything, and then everyone roll me a con. Con. Okay. Yeah. Con save. Mm, yeah. Okay. Oh no. I wanted angst. Here's angst. Oh damn! I actually. That's very good. Thanks. Ooh. Eight. Okay. Okay. Now he's gotta wait for uh, the fucking furry. Oh, so you're still there? The furries are all dead. I'm They're still all here. Dead. Let's go. You can roll. I'm still here. I have I have Aziz sheet. I can just roll. Her. Yeah. Okay. Yes. It's a cold save. Mm -hmm. Wow. I'm surprised I'm still up for this. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yep. I mean, yeah. Welcome to D and D. <laughs> <laughs> I I honestly could have told I'm gonna drop anytime soon, you know. That's right. I think it. I think we're close, right? Close to. Yeah, we're at, we're at the end now. Sorry. All right. Ooh, you. All right. After this, I'm gonna go. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So let's just let's just make this fast, since Lilibet and Creed roll. Before you start to lose consciousness, you hear, yeah, you hear a male gruffy voice that sounds almost as sounds almost robotic, and it says, "Uh, I can't. I'm I'm not gonna kill my voice." It says, "Soon, soon you will meet her." Then you lose consciousness. I got it. For and you. for what seems like, for what seems like an hour, who is that? You wait. That's just the... Wait, that's not the wrong one. <laughs> wrong one. Hold on. That's oh, wow. Octopath. So happy. <laughs> that's Octopath. Let's just use this one again. I used the wrong title. <laughs> I used the wrong title. It should be this one. There we go. You wake up in a different room. Very different from what you've been to before. And then you feel like your entire body is being cleaned up. You see your legs. Your legs are chained up. You wake up in the middle. Very round of the sick. You don't know how long it's been. You don't even know where you are. Creed, you hear the most familiar, seemingly anger inducing say to you, I must say that was quite the show you and your mentioned. Even though you almost killed Prototype. How about you're stuck in this place? As we wait for the other friend and look up and see the most annoying face, which is 
Your creator. Oh, that's her? Dang. Oh, shit. You've lost touch, bitch. Well, I will agree on that. See? But those are still prototypes. <laughs> Understand? <laughs> She's a she's an Nintendo, so <laughs> she knows she fucked up on her on her thing, so makes sense. Well, before we all go back to the dance floor, I have other friends I need to meet. But for now, and she she snaps her fingers and manacles start to appear from your feet and your arms. Just relax. Then she walks away here. The rune in the middle starts to glow and well whatever happens in between these doors we will find out in a different session this will be the end Whoa. of your story oh. 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 what the fuck oh, 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 oh. campaign time yeah another fucking 60 <laughs> episodes <laughs> Ooh, yeah Snow oh, yeah. Sid and Retro are guilty for the law. I haven't even no. reached an eight hour session yet, have I? You have. <laughs> oh, I, oh. <laughs> you so, wait, went is for. It done now? Is it, is, yeah, it's is done. It... Yeah, it's done. You can go to bed. Uh, I think I've done for... a 12 hour one shot. Thank y'all for like ha having me no, do this. You've thing. Done, no, I think you've done an eight hour. This is so. This was so fun. Honestly, yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. I, I, I mean, especially especially the investigative stuff that was also like really fun. Anyways, mm -hmm. uh, thank y'all. Goodbye. Yeah, glad you enjoyed. Good night. <gasps> Finally met her. That, there's... Yeah, it's mama. That's, I'm gonna that's a bitch. Kill that's her. Bitch. Gonna kill her wife. Gonna kill that's her, her kids. kids. Yeah, kill all no, of them. They, they, all get, they all get in these hands. <laughs> Created E for maybe, everyone. Maybe not the kids. The kids, hey, the kids didn't art, do nothing to piss off Creed. The, right. art has and, human, the art has human ears, but she's an elf, so just imagine elf ears. Honestly, she's kind of... She's kind of... Shut up. <laughs> of course, all Johnny. Are pretty <laughs> fucking gay ass. Are you gonna go and marry her now, huh? No. You're gonna betray Creed, huh? No, That's I would never. you plan on doing? Stop, no. <laughs> okay, goodbye. A little bye bit of betrayal art? No. Betrayal art. 